Oh shit. Is uh, is Vettel time? Very nice. Is Vettel? You know me as uh, Vettel. Very nice. Today we're gonna finish up with this uh, this playthrough of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets for the PC. So that's gonna be very nice. Vettel who? Oh, you know Vettel Dum Dum. You know, you know the guy who's very dumb. That's me. That's which Vettel it is. More like Lethal. Wow. It was cozy, man. We ate fondue and stuff, and uh, I talked with my parents about a lot of stuff. So it was kind of like time. Uh, time went slowly, man. So I'm sorry if I'm an hour late, but you know me. I'm usually late. It's uh, no nothing new, you know. So yeah, but let's get on with it, man. We're gonna play video game. That's what we're here for. I'm gonna adjust camera a little bit. There we go. Here you can see me. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, we're gonna go straight into the game thing here. That's My Spotify and Here's the HP background now. We have everything we need Very good Hello darkness my old friend Where was I again? Yeah, we're gonna go out of this and then we're just gonna start playing video game. Should be no problem. We have had everything set up before. So right now it should be no problem just playing the game. Since, you know, we we did the setup for it last time. So now it should just be working. Yeah, there we go. Even though it's not full screen for me right now, but we can... We can full screen it. Oh, oh I, 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 I... There we go! Okay. Everything is as it was. Yeah, we can look at where everything is. It's Horald Potter. Yes, it's him. All right, we have him uh, right here. Dude, my fucking <laughs> my pop filter is very like dusty down here, like at the bottom. Sorry about that. Sometimes it doesn't really want to work as intended. Uh, what is this? Um, okay, what the fuck was that? I don't know what that was. I prefer the Norwegian name for SpongeBob. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I was I was just about to fucking mention that. I'm not even kidding. Fucking Spretti Letti. Ah, <laughs> fucking Spretti Letti, man. He's so fucking good. The thing is, I I remember like we have uh, Richter Sempra, Scourge, Defindo, and SpongeBob, but from the Norwegian ones. Which is the ones I grew up with. I only remember Spretti Letti. I, I don't I don't I don't remember the names of the other ones. What is the Findo Scourge and Rictus Hemper on in the Norwegian one? Do you remember PC? Because my mind is just like not remembering whatsoever right now. I can't I, I legit can't remember what the name uh, of the Norwegian version was of those spells. Whatsoever, so please do tell me if you know. But Spretti Letti is really a fun thing, I, especially when Harry says it every single time you use it. It's like a oh, Spretti Letti, Spretti Letti stuff. It's kind of fun. I don't remember what we were doing now. Oh, yeah, we're gonna go to the Findo challenge. Yeah, 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 yeah. the Findo challenge or. 
Herbology. Can we do more stuff? You are here? trying my patience, Potter. Okay. Would you be interested in trading? No, not really interested. I'm sorry. No, we need the Findle for that one. Okay. I couldn't quite remember. Dude, there was a lot of beans. Skrubrunt? Wait, was that Scourge? Dude, like, immediately when I read it, I didn't remember. But when I said it, Skrubrunt, like, oh, Would you dude. Be interested in trading? It makes sense now, I remember now. What were the other ones? What was Riktus Empera? I think it was just Riktus Empera. Like, Riktus Empera or something. But the Finn, though, I don't remember. In the PlayStation 2 version, I think he just said Revenue. Because, you know, you tear, you know? I think that's what they called it there. So I guess that was what they called it in the PC version as well. I don't remember. But Spreti Letty, I remember quite fondly. Okay. No, this is... Why am I going here? This is not correct. Vettel is just messing around. This is where we're gonna get out of the challenge. And it is not where you go in. The revenue is the fin Okay, so it's... Okay, so I think the Norwegian was just... Just Riktu Sempera. Riktu Sempera. Skrubrunt. The revenue and Spreti Letty. So that was kind of nice. We can actually buy this... Now, I think. Hey, Harry! Want to trade? We what do you have? I have a Nimbus 2001, the best model available to the general public. <laughs> I had exactly enough. You are a most discerning shopper, Harry. Sorry, old friend. I'm out of stock right now. Come back later. What was the last one? Um, the Spretiletti, you mean? Spongify? I mean, there's just four spells. It's Rictus Emperor, Scourge, Defindo, and Spongify, and in Norwegian it's Riktus Empera, Skrubrunt, Revenue, and Spreti Letty. Those were the fourth spells. Oh, sorry. I just sold my very last item a moment ago. Wow. I call that a fraud. That guy was a fraud, okay. Yeah, let's go. Gulliver Pokeby. 1750 to 1839. Expert in magical birds. First to identify the meaning of augury song. Okay. A beautiful lad, I must say. Hey, hey, Ryuk. Welcome! It's my special friend who is kind and fucking gives me ape escape Welcome one. to second year. That's very cool of you, man. And for those of you who have forgotten, I am Professor Sprout. Let's dig right in, shall we? Today, I'll teach you Defindo, the severing charm. Harry Potter, would you like to plant your feet in front of class and be the first to learn the spell? I'd be glad to, Professor Sprout. Taking uh, a leaf from like the it's mind. so weird looking at Harry and then Ron because Harry's so much more detailed than Ron and everybody else. It's so weird. No problem worth it. Yeah, it's very worth no, it Mr. because Potter, oh my god, I'm gonna have so fun playing the, the game for like properly first See time pointer. casually and then speedrunning it with you later maybe. The shape. When the pointer passes directly over the arrow, press the corresponding arrow key. This exercise is in three parts. In each part. You must be accurate in order to progress. Ready to try? Round one, go. Well done, Harry. You've moved on to the next level of the lesson. Five points to Gryffindor. Pretty Round easy, two. I must say. Go.
Well done, Harry. You've moved on to the next level of the lesson. Ten points to Gryffindor. Round three, go. Well done. You've completed all of the exercises in top form. Yeah. Fifteen points to Gryffindor. Ooh. You have learnt Divindo, Harry. We've planted a seed of greatness here today. Now let's move on to the Divindo challenge. Welcome, Harry Potter, to my Divindo challenge. To complete the challenge, you must find the completion star, which can be found in a hallway just above you. Try to get to it as quickly as you can. If the challenge timer reaches zero before you have the completion star, you lose the challenge. Along the way, you will find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. I highly recommend you try to find all of them. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points I will award you. Some vines and plant growth can cover doorways and openings. You can use the window to cut through them and clear your paths. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay. Uh, we're gonna talk about stuff. Um, Spretty Letty's never done the books or movies. No, that's true. And Sprout, why are we learning spells? Yeah, I don't know why she's learning spells. It's just a game thing. PC a more more <laughs> more evening just maybe you know we have to speed run yeah I still can't believe that I actually found Ape Escape so fast yeah I, I me neither man that was just insane you just fucking out of the blue just sent me a message on Discord today like hey man look I found Ape Escape for like seventy kroner I was like what the fuck that's so insane it was, it's a very big coincidence it's actually too funny. But yeah, speedrun. I want to do some speedruns. Like, right now, I'm soon done with Super Mario Galaxy 2. Uh, on my free text is gold. Yeah, free text is really good, actually. But like, I'm I'm soon done with Super Mario Galaxy 2 on my Wii. Uh, which I haven't played in a long time. So I'm doing that 100%. And I'm soon done with it. And then I'm thinking, after I'm done with that, I was thinking maybe I'm going to play and stream a casual 100% playthrough of... Super Mario Odyssey, and then go over to speedrun some of it. I think would be a fun thing to do. And then I'm gonna play Ape Escape casually, maybe stream that, of course, and uh, do some speedruns with uh, Ryuk over here, and also teach Ryuk and set up uh, King March Randomizer, and then we could have some race later, which would be awesome to do. So PC, be ready for that. You're gonna be a moderator slash judge for... Uh, King March to randomizer run if you want to. You can be the judge and the mod and everything. You can be the one with all the secrets and the knowings of the seed we uh, we play and everything, and that should be nice. And it's a sign that you were meant to get it. Yes, I'm always moderator. Yes, you are. But you're gonna be like, you know, you're gonna actually be judge and maybe be in the chat while we do the speedruns. The races and stuff. So it's going to be three people talking to each other while we are doing uh, this uh, speedrun of uh, King Warps and stuff. So that's going to be actually pretty nice. So yeah, finally somebody to race with. So that's very good. So we found... Oh yeah, that's a thing! That's a thing I have completely, completely forgotten. You can see how many secrets there are in an area you are in. I've forgotten that is a thing, so we can see that there's 11 secrets in this Defindo challenge that we have to find. Interesting. I kind of forgot about that. I kind of forgot, I have to say, but no problem. See, now it's one secret. Down. <laughs> Sounds perfect. Yeah, Ryuk. Sounds like a perfect... I have the power, yes. PC will have the power for those speedruns. Since you're going to be the one having the seed. 
and uh, basically everything because the gen the general gist of the the only difference in me playing the Kingdom March 2 randomizer speedrun for myself and having uh, as like a race with it is like the, both of the like racers are gonna have the same seed and basically it's the same game but it's like it depends on the skill of the players and like if they're like going to the correct world first and like a lot of stuff like that so it's basically like PC will know if we're close to a thing. So for example, if I go to Olympus Coliseum early and Ryuki does not on the race, and then you PC see like, aha, there's two proofs there. And then Ryuki will not get it because he's not there and P Vettel will get it and like everything. And then there's skill and everything and yeah. There's a lot of things happening, so you know, we need to be careful about stuff. Are there... Yeah. I felt like there was something I remembered about this. There we go! Let's go, baby! The movie Min Martino Watch was pretty nice, actually. Yeah, I know. It's amazingly a very good movie. Actually, very good movie. Leopoldina Smithwick. Smithwick. I don't know how to pronounce it. 1829 to 1910. First British, British, British witch to referee a Quidditch match. I can't even talk today. Which is every day. Wait, that can't talk. That's a common theme amongst... The Findo can ah. also cut ropes that will release objects. <laughs> the Findo! Oh, it's mushrooms, man. Cork lump mushrooms ah. can give off a cloud of poisonous gas, Harry. Avoid them. Imagine knowing that or there is a proof by ending your world, but falling things. asleep only to come back when you're at your wit's end. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I was like asking for you earlier in the stream, like, where is the PC? I need to know, is the proof by the lingering wind? And then I just basically had to just look for. Once you have separated a hawk lamp from its stem, you can pick it up and It was basically, basically just me getting every single check I could f actually find. So yeah, but that level one, the frame rate, oh god, it was horrible. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, I know. It was horrible. Hey, muffin cake. Hey, Stanley. Are you doing HP three by the way? Yeah, I'm thinking of doing uh, uh, Prisoner of Azkaban for the P. Dang it! I don't like you! Uh. Yeah. I was I was thinking of doing a uh, Prisoner of Azkaban for the PC as well. It's like I grew up with this one. I played a little of the Prisoner of Azkaban, no, uh, Philosopher of F Philosopher Stone PC game uh, with my cousin on his computer. But I had never played Prisoner of Azkaban until later years, so I'm kind of still a noob in that kind of thing. So yeah. HP3 is my fave. PS2 version. Yeah, PS. That I grew up with the PlayStation 2 version of Prisoner of Azkaban. I have all the PlayStation 2 Harry Potter games, and I mean all of them, from like uh, Chamber of Secrets. No, from from Philosopher's Stone. Till the Half Blood Prince. I all have all of them for PlayStation 2. So yeah, it's kind of interesting. But yeah, uh, Chamber of Secrets PlayStation 2 is my favorite. Chamber of Secrets for PC is my favorite. Uh, but Prisoner of Azkaban is very good. But it's the PS2 version that's the better one for me. Mervyn the Malicious. Medieval dates are known, credited with the invention of many and pleasant jinxes and hexes. Well, look at him, of course he has. HP3 was the last good one. I agree on that. I agree on that. Sweet. Yeah. Only thing I would add is that the 
uh, the F Order of the Phoenix game on PlayStation 2 was very decent in like making the entire Hogwarts into like an open world and it kind of worked and it was a lot of side quests so it was kind of fun of its own merit I would say not not a bad game but I would also agree with Prison of Azkaban being the last good one proper good one but yeah so oh oh I am so beautiful. <laughs> nice name. Hi, welcome to the stream. Okay, that was an amazing name. But do tell me how you want me to pronounce your name. Because, of course, everybody wants their name to be pronounced differently and everything. So please just do tell me how you do that. Thank you for following. Thank you for following. That means a lot. Um, there is supposed to be a follow thing like a, a annotation like coming up like oh yeah i am so beautiful is now following that's usually that's usually a thing that comes up and you'll get an ice cream and stuff that's usually how it goes here on the channel but the thing that's different now is that there's been a bot around called the host bot and it's really really annoying and it's 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 just spamming the follow thing on people's like twitches and stuff so for now i've just turned it off you did follow even though there was no annotation about it i just turned it off for now because of the bots that's going around twitch right now so until that stops we're gonna have uh follows turned off for now so i hope people understand that the world was cool but there was just fetch quests yeah i don't mind how you pronounce my name so yeah hey you're on the big screen now yeah Big screen. <laughs> Big screen. Ah. But yeah, I'm gonna call you Beautiful. Because that's very cool. That was a very nice name, actually. So, yeah. But yeah, Beautiful, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Have you played Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets for PlayStation 2 or PC before? Or, like, played any Harry Potter games? Because please do tell us. We're in a Harry Potter mood right now. So please do tell, or if you have just some other memories with like the movies or the books or whatever. Why can't Harry grab on that? I would want him to grab onto that, but apparently he can't. Is there a secret down here? No. I'm gonna just look for secrets. I'm gonna not miss any secrets. I don't wanna miss anything. Large. <laughs> what? Is large. Okay, nothing more here. Spiky, prickly plants shoot their spikes a little too close. Or use diffusion to cut their stems. Flipendo! Flipendo! Dude, he's groaning so much. around here is it just trying to look for some secrets but doesn't seem to be any any of particular note at least that was a lot of the beans if Ravenclaw didn't exist what house would you be in Maybe Hufflepuff. I only really like Slytherin, of course, but I don't feel like I fit into Gryffindor. But I like Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw. But I like Ravenclaw the most, so if I were to choose anyone except for Ravenclaw, it would be Hufflepuff, I would think. A crack house. Wow, PC. Real. There's a secret. There's something that's amiss. Okay, let's see. How is this? Something is amiss. No! I messed up. I messed up. Defendor! Defendor! 
Vet du, eller mest i det... Vet du, vet du, eller något mest i det... Nei, speedrun time. We now know what to do. Ok, vi har found four. I feel like there's something that's supposed to be here, you know? I feel like I'm missing something. Aha! Uh -huh. Elric the Oddball, medieval dates on known highly eccentric wizard who is famed among other things for wearing a jellyfish for a hat. A very cool person. Would be a fun and a blast of a person to be on parties with, I would believe. Yeah, because this was another kind of secret thing. I believe. Yeah, you're too whiny to for Gryffindor. <laughs> Going fast now, yes, <Yeah>, speed! <laughs> yeah. I don't think Gryffindor would be the perfect fit for me. Well, six, we need five more secrets. Oh yeah, it's Durvin Shimpling! Durvin Shimpling, 19 drop to present, ate an entire ven venomous tentacula for a bet and survived, though it's still purple. I always remember that one, I always remember it because it's such a funny thing. Ah, uh, Durvin Shimpling. Also would be a, a cool person on a party. I mean, who the fuck eats a venomous fucking thing and then fucking stays purple? That's an amazing feat, I must say. Not everybody who can say they have done that. Sick pork buffering, was it manip? Was it, was it a manip? What? Did I pause buffer? Huh? What do you mean I was manipulating something? I didn't do a pause buff now. But I'm very confused. Defender! I didn't do any pause buff. Oh! Ah! <laughs> Nothing here. No, stop! That one chest. Oh, what? Um, I don't think I did anything special. You paused buffer error. I didn't pause buffer! Letting them out. Oh, they eat them. Oh, shit, man. That's not... Sorry, man. I'm gonna get your beans. Who's the last one? Oh, he's still in there. <laughs> the sound design on them are the best. I'm just gonna. Gonna jump over, I think. Are your pants on fire, you liar? No, beans, what the fuck? Good soup. What soup? What soup you talk about? Wait, 
little jelly because he hears soup and he wants to eat the soup. There's a secret up here. You can clearly see. So we're missing four secrets. Yeah, let's go. Okay, who's this? Blenheim Stock, 1922 present. Non-magical expert and author of many books, including non-magical who notice a study of non-magical awareness of magic. Interesting. Or as they're called, Mögel. Does Harry learn a new spell soon? I mean, he has learned a new spell. Which is Divindo. AKA this one. Where you cut stuff. Ow. Are you buying pants at the soup store? This is beans inside. Are you not on good soup TikTok? No. I'm not. I am in fact not. Oh, dude. Oh. Weird animation. Is it more? No. There's more soup. I'm at soup and culture swine. Wow. Because I'm not on good soup TikTok. I don't know what that even means. There we go. But there's also a secret with that one thing over there. I believe. Maybe not. Am I stupid? This one, this one, it has to be. Nothing, huh? Am I just stupid? I'm pretty sure there was something with that one. No, this is the one. Yeah, this is the one. There's only three more. And I've... Yeah, that counts as a secret, apparently. Okay, so we're missing three secrets. But there's this. I don't know what this shows. Maybe it's further down here? Yeah, it's further down here somewhere. I need to go back and reload it because I don't know, really know where this is supposed to take me. Oh, what a world we live in. I looked at the square in my hand and it told me a joke about soup. <laughs> what is a TikTok? Is it food? I thought TikTok was a laundry detergent. No, that's why. Vine. Oh, makes sense. <laughs> what the fuck? This is too funny, man. Too funny. Where's the... Hello? I don't want to go through here until I know where the secret is. I have walked past the secret. In some shape. Or some capacity. I'm losing time because of this, but I really don't remember. Um, let me just make sure. I'm, I don't want to lose the secret and the backtrack later. It's not gonna be fun. Are you guys watching my stream now? 
Dude, you guys are watching my stream while you're eating or whatever. That's kind of sick. Hey, happy. Oh, oh, that looks like some good food over there. Wow, what a good food you have there, Martina and Ryuk. Wow, look at that food. <laughs> Haven't seen such food ever before. <laughs> so that's a YouTube then. So Vettel, where is your TV? My TV is behind me. It's right here. Vettel has never seen food. There's my blue TV screen right now. Maybe I could have like a wallpaper in the background or something. That could actually be kind of cool to have in the background while I'm here at my home, home place. It was delish food. Oh, dude. I would want food too. I mean, I ate a lot of food. Yeah, what is it, Dandy? Why TV? Huh? What do you mean? You asked me where my TV is and I showed you my TV. Well, da, I made the beef. Ah, you made the beef, I see. Hold on, where is this? Let me just... And the Chamber of Secrets P... PC Defindo... Dogfindo, I wrote. Defindo challenge. Walk through. Well done, I made the beef. I got the personal cook. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh my god, your name. Ah. Ah. <laughs> okay. I understand that. why I have TV in my name. I mean, I wanted to just be called Vettel, you know? With Vettel, it was already used, but... The thing is, you're we we are all now on Twitch, and Twitch is it's Twitch.tv, and then there's a lot of other streamers who's just like their name and then TV. So I'm just Veterino TV. Because uh, that's just what it is. There's no different in it. It's just all this Veterino TV. I can just imagine Vettel being all sexy time with the girlfriend and he whispers in there, I'm Vettelino TV, I have many followers. <laughs> That's exactly how I seduce my girlfriend. You have correctly deduced how, how that works. Um, let's see, the Finder challenge. I went past it. Uh, Oh, okay. Apparently this gargoyle doesn't show anything. It is exclusively only for lighting up the cave right here. There's no secret room, it's just for lighting up this cave. Apparently. So there's no secret attached to this. For some reason. That's kind of like... It doesn't... Uh, I don't like that. It fooled me, you know? <laughs> It fooled me very much, and I don't like that. Um, TV is nice though. Yeah, it's not working at all. My TV is working. Yes, but that's what Lumos does. <laughs> yeah, but fuck it. <laughs> fuck it, man. <laughs> the game uses it to show secrets. And I believe it was only for secrets right now. They can't trick me like this. Only two secrets left. Two secrets left. Ah! Let's go. It's beautiful, lady. 
Eladora Ketheridge, 1656 to 1729, which who discovered the use of gibby weed when she nearly suffocated after eating it and recovered only when she stuck her head into a bucket of water. That's a classic tale of how gibby weed was found. Having a lot of Twitch followers work wonders in the bedroom. I can't confirm it. I have neither many followers nor action in the bedroom. <laughs> oh, dude, Martini one, dude. It's sad and funny at the same time, but I love your humor, man. It's a very good humor. When you pick up a flashlight, do you start looking for secrets? Yeah, I look for secrets when I take up a flashlight. Don't you? Oh, we're, we're near the end, near, near. I don't like that. One more secret. There's one more secret. Lord Stoddard Withers. Breeder of flying horses. 1672 to 1769. Breeder of flying horses. I mean, that was his uh, fame. Stupid frog. There we go. <gasps> I'm gonna find, find the secret. <gasps> Look, is where we began almost. No. Yeah, we're at the last secret, baby. Ah, oh, there's another slug. Or no? We can get another slug from over here, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, 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 okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Now we use this little guy. Put this one over here. Rip. When you pick up a flashlight, do you start looking for naughty secrets? Yeah. <laughs> you flashlight. I mean, I'm down, you bring the bedroom action, and I bring the four followers I have. Deal. Nice. Do you have four followers? That's actually kind of amazing. Yeah, I need to follow you, by the way. What did I think about that? I need to follow you, man. That's the last card. Who is this? Fedius Thurkel, 1632-1692. Famous for producing seven squib sons and turning them all into hedgehogs in disgust. Wow. Why do he do this, man? For 447, I believe. That's pretty good. And that is that from just like speedrunning like on and off? Or let's go beans. <gasps> There's the challenge star. Wow. We found it, boys. The secret chest. Well done, Mr. Potter. You have completed my Defindo challenge. The remaining time now becomes your personal high score. Pretty much, yeah, but I also do casual stuff. So, okay, nice. Nice. Well, I should do more speedruns. That's what's gonna give me some more followers, I believe. I mean, I have been streaming regularly now for... Well, two to three weeks right now. More than before. And I've gotten at least one follower. Or one, two, three every, like, stream. So that's actually pretty good. Who is this? Norval Twonk, 1888-1957. Died saving a non-magical child from a runaway manticore. Posthumously awarded the Order of Merlin First Class. That's very brave. Very brave. 
Now, if I believe correctly. No. Harry, Hermione told me that you can find the shredded boomslang skin out in the greenhouse. Follow me, Harry. Well, first of all, I think this leads over here. Yeah, there we go. Hi, Harry. My name is Emily. I don't believe that you're the heir. You just can't be. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Mirabella Plunkett, 1839 to unknown, famous for falling in love with a merman in Loch Lomond while on holiday. When her parents forbade her to marry him, she transfigured herself into a haddock and was never seen again. Ah. I want to be a haddock myself. What is it with that? Is that something we can step on? Secrets. Ah, so that opens up that so you can use the sponge of thing later. Okay. What? You got like 20 followers yesterday of it. Oh, no, I did not. It was just a bot. Have you, by the way, seen the movie about Sonia? Augustiana. I can't remember the exact name, but you know what I mean. No, I don't. True. Rise and Augustian. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh oh yeah! Yeah yeah. Okay okay. Now it makes sense. Yeah yeah yeah. I've seen that. I've seen that every Christmas. Oh my god. I just didn't connect the name you gave me. But yeah. Rise and Augustian. Yes, that's the one. Yeah. Bots are people too. <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't get more followers thanks to those follows. Either way, I'm still at the same amount that I would have been without the follow. So it doesn't really matter. Didn't really. Interested in trading? Are you interested in training? Okay, so there's four more secrets where we are right now. One of those secrets would, I guess, be up there. Mm, at least up in that like thing we opened up there. That's for certain. But there might be some more that we haven't found yet. Towards Hagrid's hut, maybe. I don't know. There's some more secrets we need to find. We need to find them all. At some point. Where they're where they are is kinda like you never know. Here's the greenhouse. It's always so warm in here. Wow, thanks for the update, Harry. It's kinda weird, but <laughs> to you too. Now, is there something uh, around here that's cool to look at? I don't think so. People are bots. Artificial intelligence. No, NPCs can have that. The huge star just reminded me of that movie in 7th grade. I was forced to sing one of the songs with Uda in front of the screen. <laughs> oh, I love that me playing a video game and you see Big Star and then you remember those like Christmas movie things that you needed to sing a song to that you didn't like. Ah, Good times. <laughs> there's not, nothing here, but I feel like there's... Yeah, there's some, something over here. And here was another secret. So. Beaumont Majory Banks, 1742 to 1845, pioneer of herbology and collector of many rare and magical flowers, discovered gillyweed. What? Huh? Okay, he discovered gillyweed. She discovered the use of gillyweed. So that's two separate things, apparently. So yeah. Wow, he found his uh, little mushrooms. <laughs> uh, the AI doesn't understand what to do. <laughs> what? Norwegian Christmas, a movie from 1976 and a movie where one guy did all the voices. Yes. <laughs> Christmas tradition. The greenhouse is right inside that door, Harry. I'll watch out for Professor Sprout. Good luck. Uh, okay, thank you. Three secrets. It's only three. 
Only three secrets. like tossing Ugh. Mr. Crab I don't like you Crab Why are you on top of the stairs? Ah! Uh, why is there another one on top of the stairs? Dude, I don't like that One found the plant, the other was brave enough to smoke it. <laughs> oh, me and Martina might play some eye toy soon. Oh nice, yeah, I have my I have I've tested on my eye toy not that long ago and it works perfectly. It's very, very good man. I don't understand all the hype with Tirenut Lasky, but why I played so much eye toy play two. Yeah me too man! I do play two and three were the most played ones on my uh, my sick. It's a classic just like Home Alone. Yeah, it's a Norwegian classic. It's it's just what it is. I remember one year in Ungdom School where all the teachers showed some showed Home Alone in all the classes, so I watched the movie like six times because they are stupid. Why didn't the teachers like talk about that? What the fuck? I mean, why did okay? It's honestly though, why did none of you actually just like like say, "Hey, teacher"? I mean, we watched this movie with this teacher the other day. Do we need to watch this too? Like, did you guys do that, or did you, did no none of your like classmates bother just? Telling the teacher that you've already seen it, like at least twice. Like what? I do play as God, like yeah, nice. I do is God. Yeah, it's God. Confirmed. Flipendo! Secret. Now, where does this open up? Does it open up in here or... Yeah. We found two of the secrets. So we said that, but they were like, we don't have another movie, so we had to watch it. What the fuck, I see so many secrets I never found. <laughs> Sakarisa Tugwood, 1874 to 1966, pioneer of beautifying potions, discovered the pimple curing properties of Bubutuber Pus. Wow. That sounds like a YouTuber of some sort. He has so many pronunciations of the same spell. Exactly one pronunciation of the same spell. <laughs> Whoever did the voice acting for like some of the enemies are godlike, especially the gnomes. Oh no, he's a spider. This is a particularly nasty variety of spider. Their bites are extremely poisonous, so stay away and cast Rictusempra to stun them. Okay. Rictusempra. That was it. Divindo. Oh, ah. Rictusempra. Divindo. Then we have the the three fellas. There we go. A boob tuber? <laughs> it's called Twitch Thoughts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, it's Twitch Thoughts, not boob tuber. <laughs> boob tuber. But the real question is what Home Alone movie was it? They only had four. Why is the spider so gross? Even though it's so old, spiders can be cute. Cat are cute? What do you mean? Look at the spiders. The first one. It is the best one, but you kind of get sick of it when you have to watch it too many times. Yeah, I kind of like the first one. 
uh, particularly well. Um, second one was also good, but th uh, three and four, they aren't, they aren't kind of Home Alone movies, but like, it's a, it's it's very special because Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone and the Chamber of Secrets and Home Alone one and two were directed by Christopher Columbus, the same guy, and they, this they both have like a very same feeling, kinda. Both give off a really like Christmassy feeling, I feel like. Because that's the thing, when you have the Christmas in the first movie and the second movie, it's really like Christmassy. But in the further movies, they don't really bother with Christmas. Maybe the Yule Ball, but that wasn't really anything special either. So it's not kind of weird, I must say. But yeah, it's kind of special. My fave has to be the second one, because it has the bird lady. Ah, the bird lady. Put the beans on the roof, man. Harry Potter are Christmas movies. Yeah, I feel like fall to like Christmas is the best times to watch Harry Potter. Fall and like Christmas times. The second was really good too, yeah. But the third and fourth is so bad, yeah. I don't like those. Okay, everybody. Favorite Harry Potter movie and least favorite Harry Potter movie. Let's go. That is movie. Specifically, favorite Chamber of Secrets, uh, the, 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 the least favorite. I think maybe Order of the Phoenix. Yeah, Tilly Talk, 1903 to 1991, gained the Order of Merlin first class for saving non-magical lives during the Ilfracombe incident of 1932, when a dragon swooped down on a beach full of sunbathers. Die Hard is also a Christmas movie. Yeah, it's really Christmas. Harry Potter and the Christmas of Santa. My least favorite is Order of the Phoenix 2. Yeah, fame. Best is 3, worst is 4. Yeah, 4 is kind of down there for me too, actually. I, th I think it's at the bottom, it's F uh, Order of the Phoenix and then uh, the uh, Goblet of Fire, I think. But I really love Chamber of Secrets. I don't, I don't really know why. Many people don't really like it. I like it. And the reason why is I don't really know. I just love it. And I... There's a lot of things about it, but... I feel like Gilroy Lockhart is a good thing for that too, because Gilroy Lockhart is the best fucking character. And the best... Um, Defense Against Dark Arts teacher, in my opinion. Favorite Azkaban, least favorite Order of the Phoenix. I think because of poor series. I don't know, it's hard. I I feel like fin Order of the Phoenix is the least favorite for mine because it's not that hey, Hermione. good. I found a bunch and it's of a lot of things from the book that's the not there at all potion. because it's... That's great, Harry. Yeah, it, they couldn't fit in everything. Right now. <sighs> the weekly ass point ceremony is starting soon. You remember where it is, don't you? Yeah. I know where it is. You don't need to show me. My fave is to I can watch it so many times and at least I have to agree in order Phoenix. Yeah, you see, many people agree, but oh dude, I love fucking Chamber Secrets. Imagine having Dobby in more than two movies. Preposterous. Yeah, I mean that's also a thing. Potter, you will now duel a member of your own team. Don't expect any special treatment from them. Expelliarmus! 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 Potter has beaten a fellow Gryffindor. How very disloyal. They cut out baby head Death Eater that itself makes the movie <laughs> 0 out of 10. Yeah, so why wasn't Dobby more in the movies? I don't know why. Dobby was a very cool character as well. Because he got his sock, he became happy. <laughs> yeah, and that happened in the second movie. <laughs> you know? It was special. Special time. Really special. May I now introduce your next opponent? Expelliarmus! Expelliarmus! Let that go to your head, Potter. Expelliarmus! 
I mean, these fights are really easy because you just have to do this twice. Oh, int hp dialogue dot all. <laughs> okay. I don't know why. No Dobby Blinky love story. <laughs> no, that's true too. Oh, Blinky. That's the thing. Why did they remove Blinky? I don't like that. Blinky would have been a cool character for the movie, but no, they didn't add the Blinky. I also want to see the kitchen where all the other Husnisser was. I want to see them tickle the pair to get in. Oh yeah, true, true. You if you let your guard down, Hufflepuff. Rick to Sempra! Rick to Sempra! Rick to Sempra! Expelliarmus! Rick to Sempra! 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 I can lead you to me beat Hufflepuff. Must be a fluke. No spoo, sad Blinky who was drunk in the kitchen. Yeah. Oh. Dude, there was a lot of things from the books that were really good and would have been a really really good addition to the movies as well. So I really don't know why they like removed them. It was actually kinda cool most of the things that they had in the books. So I don't know. Some bad uh, choices, but that's why I love Chamber of Secrets, because there's a lot of things from the Chamber of Secrets book that are still present in the movie. Potter, there's a little thing here and there that, that is removed, but still it's pretty good. Potter get to you. Strike him back. Rick to Sempra. Rick to Sempra. Rick to Sempra. Harry Potter has beaten Slytherin. Looking forward to my reread of HP. Yeah, I'm looking forward to reading the books again soon. It's been a little while since I've done that. I'm gonna either borrow the books from my sister or Stanley. Since I don't really have the books myself, but I really want to have like a... I really want the OG version of the books. Like the OG version that was released when the books came out. I really want to have those. It'll probably be a little difficult to get though, but... The one thing I wanted in the movie was when all the house elves came out of the kitchen in the Potter, seventh and started stabbing you people. Now duel a member of your own team. Yeah, true, that was a thing too. That was a thing too. Oh my god, that was actually kind of true. Well, I mean, they would have had that scene in the final movie if, you know, they wouldn't have removed the kitchen part altogether from, like, you know... The earlier movies. Because there would have been no point to have it in later. But no lucky. That's kind of sad. That would have been so cool. You can borrow mine when I have read them again, but I have to finish the stupid last Twilight one. You have used so much fucking time, and you've been complaining, oh, I need complete silence to read, but now you've been in your apartment for a long time, so now you fucking should read them, man. I read all of my Junji Ito books now. Lately, those are of, of course there are comics, of course they're manga, but like still, oh. I read absolutely every Junji Ito book that has been released so far, and then like a couple, like a week or two ago or three or something, he released a new book, which I'm gonna when I'm back in Hamar again when we're gonna do the the D and D thing for uh, uh, PC when we're gonna do D and D with Fred and stuff again. In like next weekend sometime uh, I'm gonna go to Outland in Hamad because I've like pre not pre-ordered but I've like hello can you like have this off for me until the next week so I can pick it up because they got the new book it's called Sensor Junjito Sensor and then read that it's gonna be cute but they look a little rough because I read them so much and it's in Norwegian, but that's no problem. This is an intense tennis match, I know. Haha, I'm sorry, but it's so boring. I don't like reading Twilight in Edward's perspective in English. <laughs> ah, well, get through it then. You're gonna get through it at some point. There's still some secrets in the school that we haven't gotten. Uh, yeah.
I miss Fred's D&D. Yeah. It's gonna be fun to do D&D again. I can just stand here. Oh. A hard blow given to that raven claw. Expelliarmus! Rictus Emperor! Come on, just. Expelliarmus! There we go. I don't like these Rictus blocks. Rictus Emperor! Rictus Emperor! Rictus Emperor! Rictus Emperor! How could it change so fast? Like, what is this AI? There we go. But we are playing now <laughs> over Discord. Yeah, I miss it in real life. That's a fair point. In real life, DD is a little different from the DD you have over the interwebs. But yeah, um, just a quick question to to you, Ryuk. By the way, uh, do you want to uh, do you want me to set up and like uh, do things for the um, HP random uh, HP Today, randomizer? What? Potter, I meant Kingdom Hearts randomizer this week. Do you want me to set that up with you this week, or do you want to do it at a later date? Just wondering because then I can look forward to something this week. <laughs> Just shoot me with a regular spell. No! Oh! Oh, did I lost so much health? Oh my god! Potter, get to you. Strike him back. Richter Sempra How can she There we go has beaten Slytherin Oh yeah, seven hour sessions. Yeah. <laughs> oh yes, please! I want the randomized South Park game. How would you want that? Like, I mean, I could program that. If I had time, I could program that, but how would that work? How would South Park... Any of the South Park games be randomized, though? What should be randomized? Like, the items or where the quests are? Like, what should be randomized, you know? There has to be something special about it to make it work. Did you finish it, by the way? I can't remember. Yeah, yeah, we finished uh, Fracture Butthole. Will now duel a member of your own team. The snowball game. Oh yeah, the 64 one. Ah, oh, nice. Oh my god. That took a long while. Beaten down by your own house. There we go. I just lost the game. <laughs> the boss fights? That's not what Expelliarmus does, Harry. <laughs> I mean, I guess the boss fights could be a thing to randomize. Not really sure, but could be something to look into, actually. But yeah, Ryuk, if you want, we could set up a session where I can set it up for you and we can try it out and stuff like that. Could be something we could do. Okay, so this is the last guy. We bet 200 on the match and we win 200 if we win. And it's just a small arena. Oh my god. Today, Potter. You will have the pleasure of dueling the great Spelly 
It's just about tennis, man. It's just tennis match. That's all it is. Now there's nothing to block me, so that's good. There we go. That's not what this permit does. I know. But we won 400. Which, I mean, we won 200 again. Tennis, yeah! But now we can basically just do that fight over and over and just earn a lot of beans. So that's it. So now we are the dueling champion. Look, Harry and Peter. <laughs> but we are on the top of the wizarding duel. Now we can go away from this. That was just a minor tangent just to get uh, the championship and dueling done. Nothing uh, out of the ordinary there. Now actually, now that I think about it, we can actually go here now. What card was this? Mopsus, ancient Greek soothsayer who vanquished the seer Calchas in a contest of their powers. Interesting. Expel e oh, most many beans, all the beans, yes. Yeah. Bowman Wright, fourteen ninety two to fifteen sixty famous for developing the golden snitch. Yeah, let's go, golden snitch creator. Aloha Mora! Yeah! Hello everyone. Looks like it's time for another house point ceremony. Let's see which house is ahead this week. Oh, it appears that Gryffindor is in the lead. Harry, Shocker. it looks like you get to visit the bonus bean room. Okay, bye bye. Allahu Mura. Harry, go to the bean room. Oh, there's a bouncy pad here, too. Yes, beans! <laughs> beans everywhere, baby! Let's go get the beans. is fun and all. That's what I usually say. Scourge! Just need to get more beans. Wait, that path was wasted. Precious bean time. No, it did not. It was the perfect route. Now oh, we're soon done though, but... Yeah, there we go. In the second week of December, Professor McGonagall collected the names of those who would be staying at school over Christmas. Harry, Ron and Hermione signed up. They heard that Malfoy was staying, which struck them as very suspicious. The Christmas holidays would be the perfect time to use the Polyjuice Potion and try to worm a confession out of Draco. I ought to head up to Moaning Myrtle's bathroom and see how the Polyjuice Potion is coming on. I hope Hermione doesn't need any more ingredients. I don't know why he whispered so softly there, but... 
So there's three more secrets here. This one is counting as a secret, I would believe. This one we we have been in here. So that's that's not new, but we just there's some more secrets, but mo more of them are like below. So I would assume that we get to them later. It's a different store in here though. Rip the other beans. A porto beans! <laughs> There's three more secrets. We're gonna get to them. We're gonna be happy to do these when we can. Okay, let's skip this. Let's skip this. I know a skip. Wait, hold on. I know a skip for this. No! Dang it! Oh no! Not another attack! Mr. Potter? What's happened to you? I don't know! I found him like this! Follow me, E. Potter. Interesting. Accio beans. Fail speedrunner. I swear I didn't <laughs> This is out of my hands, Potter. Failed speedrunner. <laughs> Through this door, please, Potter. I'm gonna go up to one of the coolest rooms in the video game. Professor Dumbledore's office. This must be Professor Dumbledore's study. Cutscenes keep. Hembledore will eat you now, <laughs> Potter. Dumledore. <laughs> ah, dang it, man. Dumledore. That's apparently a secret. I always found Dumbledore's office to be such a cool and like chill room to be in. Like, in general, it's such a cool, cozy room. Oswald Beamish, 1850 to 1932, pioneer of goblin rights. Murdoch Muldoon, 1429 to 1490, Chief of Wizards Council from 1448 to 50. A real Scottish dude, I must say. Oh. That bird looks sick. It burst into flames. <laughs> Sad. This humble Dumbledore card, card. Bean. Thank you. We are supposed to talk to this hat. It's the old school sorting hat. I wondered where it was kept. You've been wondering whether I put you in the right house. Yes, you were particularly difficult to place. But I stand by what I said before. You would have done well in Slytherin. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Good evening, Harry. Oh. Professor! Your bird! I couldn't do anything! He just caught fire! Fox is a phoenix, Harry. 
Phoenixes burst into flame when it is time for them to die and are reborn from their ashes. Fascinating creatures, phoenixes. They can carry immensely heavy loads. Their tears have healing powers, and they make highly faithful pets. Professor, I just want you to know that it wasn't me. I'm not the attacker. I know you're not, but I still want to talk to you. I must ask you, Harry, whether there is anything you'd like to tell me. Being able to talk to snakes was what Salazar Slytherin was famous for. Anything at all? No, there isn't anything, Professor. Very well, if you're sure. Good night, Harry. Night, Professor! <laughs> Foxes, Here you are! You need to go to Moaning Myrtle's bathroom. Hermione's waiting for you! Four. <laughs> There's some weird cards like a guy who had jellyfish on him. I know. One minute of silence for the bird. Oh my gosh! Heavy loads. <laughs> Yeah, is there? The dark arts classroom. yeah, I know this. Just a lot of paintings. Just wondering if there was something special here. At all. I wonder why this door is locked. Oh well. Well, uh. why is there no stair up there? I thought there was gonna be a stair up there. Oh, just spiders, man, dude, what the fuck? Well, there was nothing special. You never know, maybe Fox is like a Vaporeon. What do you mean? Follow okay. me, Harry! Huh? Huh? <laughs> Can somebody please clip that? <laughs> Here, Harry! It just jumps off the ledge. Fucking suicide. Oh my god. Because <laughs> <laughs> wizard needs no stare. No, no. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. We can't do this shit. We can't do anything with this yet. Oh my god, that was too funny. Where are we going? We don't need stairs. Lockhart, probably. Whee! I mean, I guess this is like a shortcut there. So, I mean, he did kind of do the correct thing, but at the same time, like, what the fuck, Ron? If Ron jumps off the stairs, would you do it too? Maybe. Maybe I would. Here's Flitwick's charms classroom. Uh, nicely noted, Harry. Is there a secret behind there? Oh, ah, we got we got another health bar. Let's go. How fat. Balfour Belain, 1566 to 1629, established the Committee on Experimental Charms. Makes sense that that was here, though. Makes a lot of sense. We're soon there. We're ha we have 30 out of 50 uh, bronze cards. So that's special. Um Lot of beans today. Follow me, Harry. <laughs> nice. I'm in the transfiguration classroom. Wow. Nice, Harry. Why could we go here though? Like there's nothing here. I thought maybe there was a chest here as well. For like a card or something, but there was nothing. It's just a transfiguration classroom. That's it. Well, well.
legendary clip. Yeah, it was a very nice clip. I feel very uncomfortable being in the girls' bathroom. I wish people would stop interrupting my peace and quiet. I do have feelings, you know, even if I am dead. She's very touchy, isn't she? <coughs> What's that horrible stink, Hermione? That will be the polyjuice potion. Now, we need one more ingredient for the potion to be completely effective. We're going to need a bit of goyle to complete the potion. That's disgusting! But how will I find goyle? At this time, he's usually filling his face down in the dungeons. How would you know All that? All you need though? to do is follow the trail of food, get the bit of goyle and bring it back here to me. Good luck, Harry. Uh, thanks, Ron. Mm, pieces of meat. Alohomora! So we already found the secret, so that's... Stenestina! It's your smelly dick, Harry. Her main is dogs. She stalks all the people, man. Apparently. You can now go do the secret down here as well now. Because what was be behind here was this, and then we did this. And then we could see... was it this corner? Yeah. We can see this. And here we go. Gwendolyn the Weird, medieval dates unknown, alleged to have joined being burnt at the stake so much that she allowed herself to be captured 14 times in various disguises. Nice, I guess. Still just two secrets in uh, the hallway area. Go to Horny Yale. <laughs> horny Yale for you, man. Look, it's a piece of food floating. There's Goyle. There's Goyle. I'd better follow him. Eight secrets here, so we need to be careful to get all of them. Roderick Plumpton, 1889-1987, secret for England Quidditch team, holds British record for fastest, fastest capture of snitch during game, three and a half seconds. Lupendo! That's very interesting, actually. That's a cool record and all. Lupendo! Won't you agony? So that's secret just to get these three beans. We could, we could, we could have almost jumped from here to get that. What the fuck? I thought there was something more special, but apparently, it's just beans up on these. But as you know, they're beans, so we need to collect them. Or we don't really need them. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna say we need. I wanna sit here and relax, man. There's some beans there. I missed. Missed some beans, but it's fine. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Oh! Oh! Vettel Parkour Master. We're in the big uh, chimney, man. Flipendo! 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 Am I supposed to push it in now? Flipendo! 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 
Vet du, eller du confused? Little, very confused. No, I think it's supposed to fall down here, but why isn't it? We're supposed to do this and then go back up again. there now how do we get there because i think this was supposed to help me there but now it doesn't seem to help me anymore how the fuck am i gonna do this are you saying beans aren't worth a secret wow i don't know how to solve this problem we are in right now We're in a bit of a pickle right now. We can't seem to... Can we do some skip here or... Oh, that's actually almost. Hold on. Oh, come on. Come on. Harry, you can do it. Oh! There we go. We skipped it. Nice. Guess I'll die. No, don't do that, man. No, let me get the, let me get the card. Ignatia Wildsmith, twelve twenty-seven to thirteen twenty, which invented flu powder. Flu powder, you say? Interesting. Very peaceful. Ah! It's a very big cramp. Go in. Just to open this, I guess. This was a this was a secret one. That was beans. Let's go. This is what's supposed to be where we should go, or if that was an optional path. I kinda can't remember right now. No, that seems to be optional. Yeah, it seems to be optional. Supposed to go there. <laughs> I think this is where I'm supposed to go. I'm really not sure. I don't remember.
Let's go. Oh, and we're there. This is no secret, but we got the card. Beatrix Bloxon, 1794 to 1810. Author of the Toadstool Tales, a series of children's books since banned because they have been found to cause nausea and vomiting. Okay, the lady in picture seems very old. But the person just lived for 16 years. No. Yeah, 16 years. So maybe there's a typo here, maybe. Maybe she lived to 1910, maybe? I don't know. The picture didn't seem to match the person we saw. Okay, there's a save thing there, so I guess... I could do that through the thing, but okay. I don't know where to go now, but we're going to, we're going to, we're going to play some eye toys. So see ya, have fun. Nice. Have fun. Good luck, have fun, as Peter said. Hope you guys have fun playing. Let's see how this goes. Ah, you could. Okay. So it just showed you can go up here. For whatever reason. Also shows that there's a thing here. More beans. Is it lagging out or whatever? What's that sound? Come out here, yeah. So this is where we're supposed to go. more secrets. A lawnmower? Yes, it was a lawnmower, man. That may have been what the sound was. Oh! Ah! No, oh, I knew there was something. Moan lover. <laughs> One of those. <laughs> Moan lover, yes. What was this? Devlin Whitehorn, 1945 to present. Founder of the Nimbus Racing Broom Company. Okay, so he was the founder of uh, the Race Broom Company. Oh. <laughs> 
Oh, it's Edgar Strugler, Strugler. Edgar Strugler. 1703 to 1798, inventor of the sneakers. Uh. Uh. I, I had. Uh, I had the heel of the big racist. What do you mean? Why was he a big racist? I guess you were talking about Whitehorn. New mobs. New mobs. I don't Scourge. like you, man. Two more secrets. Oh, frog! It's a lot of frog, man. Oh, give me them frog. I don't know how Goyle managed to come all the way out here, though. He's sleeping down there, like there he is, down there, like what the fuck? Because he made the race company. No. <laughs> I don't I don't think that was what it was meant to be, man. It was meant to be like racing, not race as in like you know humanity race, you know. That's not the same thing. <laughs> Whatever makes you sleep at night, what the fuck? Is there lawn, uh, lawn mower? Or lawn mower? Lover. Oh, what's the last secret, man? What was this? Cirque, or Circe, ancient Greek. L lived on island of Aiea. Expert at turning lost sailors into pigs. Wow, amazing. Hello, Mr. Lawn Moaner. Cersei, it's Greek myth. Is it present Cersei? Cersei, okay. Cersei, I don't I never know how to pronounce that name, but now I know it's Cersei. I have to be careful to not wake Goyle. There he is, sleeping like a particularly ugly baby. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
<laughs> what kind of comment is this? <laughs> there he is, sleeping like a like a particularly particularly ugly baby. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, that was kind of good. Like a particularly ugly baby. Oh, dude. I crack map. I ne don't need to wake him. Alahomora! Just shout it out, man. What the fuck? Oh, that's a word. <laughs> Particularly ugly baby. He's so small now. Oh, we got it. I need to take the bit of Goyle back to Hermione in Moaning Myrtle's bathroom. Why do you whisper here? But when we were next to Goyle, you don't whisper. You just shout Alahomora for some reason. Done, mate. M mate. There you go. Rather you than me. Thanks. Oh. Harry. Ugh, that is disgusting. Mm. This music is very good though. I love this music. Sheesh, Harry. <laughs> Are you okay, uh, Harry? Yeah, I'm fine. Go down to the dungeons and see if you can get into the common room. Okay. Good luck, uh, Harry. Alohomora. <laughs> 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 Cassandro Oblatsky, 1894-1997, celebrated seer and author of Unfogging the Future. What was this again? Oh, sound and video. This is a girl's bathroom. You're not a girl. Am I not? Huh? You're not a girl. <laughs> You're not a girl. Oh, this music. Very good music, I must say. Ouch! I can make some more potions, can't I? How do I use them again? Is it like. Control, apparently. Sounds like a hat in time music. Yeah, actually, I kind of do that. Kind of does. Your blood. What's the password? 
Alberto can use that to get into the Slytherin common room. Pure blood. Eight secrets. Let's go. This is where I'm supposed to go, though. It doesn't seem to work. No wonder the Slytherin are so moved all the time. They have to fight just a bunch of stuff for them to do platform just to get to bed at night. Yeah. Just curious, where can I get the game if... If... It, huh? Just curious, where can I get the game if it still has a tunnel? They really hated that house, didn't they? I mean, yeah. Um... Uh, you can get the games on. Where was okay? Where did I get again? Let me just Google Kikili. If I remember correctly, it's. oldgamesdownload.com It's a website which pre preserves a lot of old games and you can just download the game there and just run it on your PC after that. It's just oldgamesdownload.com It sounds kind of shady but it's a proper website with proper people and proper mods and everything so it's no problem. I downloaded it there and it was safe. So there's no problem with doing it there yourself. <sighs> oh, let's see. Thanks, no problem. No problem. You can find other like PC games there as well if there's some old PC games you're looking for. Okay, let's go. I mean, Slytherin has to do a lot of shit just to get to bed, as you said, PC. Your Slytherin, the ambitious house, has to fight stuff, but Gryffindor, the brave house, doesn't. Yeah. Well, he missed one. was one out of eight secrets. <laughs> Elfrida Clagg, 1612-1687, Chieftainess of Warlock's Council. Oh. 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 
That's the weirdest sound I've heard in a while. <laughs> it just gets worse. <laughs> Can I go down here? I feel like I'm gonna die if I go down here. Safe to, yeah, it's safe to go down here. I feel, I feel like this was something you could interact with, but apparently not. Kind of weird. Fall down there. Okay. Don't worry, first years, you'll need to cross this falling bridge. Make sure you don't fall to your deaths. This absolutely makes no sense whatsoever. It has no story relevance at all. And did and actually they have to know some spells to like get to their dormitories at the like they need to know Lumos, they need to know Flipendo and like stuff. They need to know some stuff. They need to know some shit to get to their beds at night. Adelbart Waffling, 1899-1981, famous magical theoretician. Ah, Waddlebart. What a beautiful name you have, Waddlebart. Bye-bye. At the start of the year, there's just a bunch of first years sleeping by the entrance so that they learn the necessary spells. Well, yeah, it's basically how this works. Ah. Okay, I need five more secrets. Now we need to, yeah. Oh yeah, uh, we're here already. Okay, that's a developer. That's a developer fucking picture. That was a secret, but there wasn't anything in the secret, you know. Huh? 
Huh? Oh. Also, chest there. I'm so confused. Look closer at dev pick. Uh, yeah, I'll I'll look more into it. Who's this? Justus Pilliwickle, 1862 to 1953, celebrated head of the Department of Magical Law Enforcement. Justus Pilliwickle. There's a dead spider here now. And here too. Slytherin. Look at that grin. Look at that grin on that face, man. Oh. Pretty face. Speak speaking of pretty face. You're just a second year student. I don't have time to talk to second years. Booty. Mm. Let's lock all the Gryffindors outside until frost forms on them. Um. What's the hurry, Goyle? How mean people are. Hi, Goyle. You're so mean. Everybody's so mean, man. Got a new card, baby. Oh, it's the... It's a fucking uh, goblin serial killer. Yardley Platt. Serial goblin killer. Yes, 1446 to 1557. It's just two more secrets. Two more secrets. That shouldn't be too difficult to uh, find. I believe. Yay, murder! <laughs> murder, boys. Happy holidays, Goyle. Want to break other people's presents later? Oh, um. Okay, there's just one secret left. One secret left. I just need to make sure because I don't remember if I can walk freely down there. Morgan Le Fay, medieval, dates or not. King Arthur's half sister, dark sorceress, enemy of Merlin. Yes.
Anything you want to share with the class? I'm trying to figure out because I'm missing... If I remember correctly, we're missing one secret. And I'm kind of scared of going down here because I don't remember the last secret. And I know that we're going to have to run from students soon. Don't think. You can buy any cards you miss. Well, that's true, but still. I don't want to miss anyone. Hi, Goyle. Happy holidays, Goyle. Want to break other people's presents later? There's something different about you, Goyle. You don't look so cruel and stupid. The house cup belongs to Slytherin by right. Gryffindor won't rob us of it this year. Hi, Goyle. People are the mean. There's something different about you, Goyle. You don't look so cruel and stupid. You don't want us to call for Professor Snape, do you? Sorry, I guess. There you are, Goyle. I've been looking all over for you. Come on, follow me. You know, Goyle, I suppose Dumbledore's trying to hush up all these attacks. He'll be sacked if they don't stop soon. And as for St. Potter, he's another one with no proper wizard feeling. And people think he's Slytherin's heir. I wish I knew who it is. I could help them. You must have some idea who's behind it all. You know I haven't, Goyle. How many times do I have to tell you? But I know one thing. Last time the Chamber of Secrets was opened, a mudblood girl died. So I bet it's a matter of time before one of them's killed this time. I hope it's Granger. Yeah, I always act out of this world. Uh, Draco, I'd best be going. Wait, are you only there going in the story? Where? Yeah. Uh, to the hospital wing. Yes, that's it. The hospital wing. I've got a stomachache, and I need to get something <laughs> for it. Oh, Go on then. I don't want you hanging around here all night with that pained expression on your face. Okay, now we're supposed to go, but I believe the last secret is up to the boys' dormitories. I think. Yeah. Yes, there was the last secret, man. It's only beans, but we got it. Okay, now we can escape. This is a fun part. A very fun part. Go on then. I don't want you hanging around here all night with that pained expression on your face. I better try to keep my distance from the Slytherins and sneak out. If they spot me in here, who knows what might happen? Who knows what might happen? They will kill you. <laughs> Something's not right. Professor what Snape. What are you doing down here? Uh, Harry Potter. Something no, is not you can't right. be in here. Professor Snape. Uh. Okay. The news that nearly headless Nick I miss being on Draco. I heard they enjoy like a dark cloud when everyone got back from holiday. 
If a ghost can be petrified, the students thought, then no one is safe. The first years moved around the castle in tight-knit groups, afraid they might be attacked if they ventured out alone. A furious trade in talismans, amulets, and other protective devices was sweeping the school. In the meantime, Harry had learned that Draco Malfoy was not the heir of Slytherin. But if it isn't Draco, and it isn't Harry, who is it? Harry, Harry, it's time for our defense against the Dark Arts class. Yes, Not Rob. Class again. It's wrong. It'll be wonderful. Professor Lockhart is going to teach us Spongify. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. And the music in that challenge is also fucking amazing. Ron is the heir of Slytherin. I think it's Dumbledore. Oh, yeah. Maybe it is Dumbledore. Okay, we're gonna do some Quidditch now. Since I know we have the Nimbus and we can do Quidditch whenever, so we can probably do Quidditch now. Because we haven't had, you can see we can have five matches now. It's Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and stuff like that. Match. A glint of gold. Is that the snitch? Here comes Potter. Here comes the Hufflepuff seeker. <laughs> Hufflepuff in possession. Look out for that blunder, Harry. That looks like we've done some damage if they hit. Uh, just kicking the guy. He turns, he misses. Come on, Harry. Uh, sorry, oh, a near miss for Potter. Amazing skill. Look at Potter go. Yeah. I love British so much. <laughs> yeah, British is very good. A very good language. Yeah, we won, maybe. It's a great day for a Quidditch match. Bro. Rain or shine, day or Boa night. Wah. Poor huh? clumps on the pitch or ghouls in the Boa. stands. Boa Nothing wah. keeps the crowds away from a Quidditch Boa match. Boa. Oh yeah, you're trying to say Pitch bottle of ready, water. The yeah. quaffles are polished. Boa wah. The bludgers are humming. Let's play Quidditch. Boa wah. <laughs> I now understand what you're saying. Yes! The snitch! Got to see the snitch! Blood to Harry Potter! Here comes the Ravenclaw Seeker! Look out for that bludger, Harry! Ravenclaw in possession! Here comes the bludger! Get away, Ravenclaw. I'm gonna kick you in the face. No! No! He misses! Ravenclaw girl is gonna come back, there we go. Potter of the Gryffindor side is closing in on the snitch. This is amazing! There we go. Knock that bitch off, Harry! Can we skip this? No. This is Lee Jordan signing off. points there too. I love how British you guys have no lips. Yeah. That's it's actually a a, that's actually a thing. Yes. Oh it's Draco! It's Draco! Oh no! Here comes the Gryffindor Seeker! Let's kick him when we when the he gets Wow. But it does not help up here, that's it, my boy. Oh dude. Kick fucking mouth in the face, man. Oh. 
Fuck you, Malfoy. Potter of Gryffindor narrowly misses the snitch. Oh, hard luck, Gryffindor. Take the initiative. No! The snitch got away. I just kick him so many times, it's so fucking fun. There we go. This is Lee Jordan, signing off. Okay, then it's the, this match. It's a great day for a two matches left. One more match left. Gryffindor has won the match. After another fine match of Quidditch at Hogwarts, this is Lee Jordan signing off. It's a great day for a Quidditch. He's off to the snitch. Bludger! Here comes the Ravenclaw seeker. Uh, uh, Awful taken by Ravenclaw. Uh, Gryffindor keeper died. The missing. Good effort there. Potter of Gryffindor narrowly misses the snitch. Keeper dives. Oh, and saves. Look out for Bludger, Harry. Oh! I'm <laughs> just rushing the ball. Ravenclaw scores! Harry Potter closes on the snitch! Come on, Harry! Uh, sorry, Professor. Potter of the Gryffindor side is closing in on the snitch! Look at Potter go! The crowd is on its feet! Come on, Harry Potter! Come on, can I get it please? There we go. Are you excited about the stream tomorrow? Yeah. Looking a little forward to it. Should be fun. Man, look at those scores. The rest of Gryffindor team fucking sucks. <laughs> yeah, they kinda do. So as you can see... Uh, it went well. So now we just have this match left. But all of these points we got go to the house point cup. So that's nice. Because now we have 731. And then we're also going to get some points from the challenge we're going to go to now. So that's nice. Oh. Cheers! Yeah, cheers! Let's go and do the Spotify challenge, boys. Hello, Harry. Hello, man. I think I'm allergic to wigan tree bark. Um, okay. Harry, we don't want to be late for Professor Lockhart's class. No, no, what no. What do you mean, we? <laughs> what do you mean, we? Mm. 
I'm allergic to Uyghur too. Wow. It's Mona Lisa, but it's not Mona Lisa. What the fuck? Put like Mona Lisa. No. Oh. Welcome back to your favorite class, Gryffindor students. Wow. Please hold your applause while we learn to spongify. Harry Potter, you look eager to soak up a little knowledge. Step up in front of class and we'll show them how it's done. Lucky me. <laughs> this is my favorite spell challenge. Concentrate on the symbol before you. And don't let my good looks distract you. The wand that appears in front of you is going to move around the shape. When the wand is positioned perfectly over the arrow, press the corresponding arrow key to hit the target. There are three parts to this exercise. In each part, Lucky you me. must correctly <laughs> and accurately hit all of the points in order to go forward. Round one, begin. Well done, Harry. You've advanced to the next round. Five points to Gryffindor. Thank you. Round two, begin. Say, Lockhart, it's a for all all you want. Well he fought done, you two Harry. spells. McGonagall didn't teach you any. Ten points to true, Gryffindor. True, true though, very true. Round three, begin. You have a point. That makes him the best dark arts teacher. Great work, lad! You completed all of the exercises. 15 points to Gryffindor. Yeah. You've done it, Harry! Uh, you there's a spider on me, what the fuck? Spongify! There's a spider now, on me. You can take the Spongify challenge. What the fuck? Why is there a spider on me? Ugh. Welcome, Harry Potter, to the Spongify challenge. To complete the Remus challenge, Lupin was the best find ending the completion no, it, no. star, which can be found several floors above us. Try to get to it as quickly as you can. If the challenge timer reaches zero before you Too have the completion for me. star, you lose the challenge. Along the way, you will find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. I highly recommend you try to find all of them. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points will reward you. Uh, Jose M. Rome or Jose M. Rome. Thank you for following, by the way. Uh, have an ice cream is what I would have said, but follows follow uh, notifications are off right now because of a bot that's going around Twitch. Hogwarts. You can cast Spongify on them, and they will propel you to a higher area when you jump on them. Look for this symbol on the ground to find hidden Spongify pads. <laughs> I'm trying to find secrets right now. But I don't think there's any se Ah! I was gonna say there's no secrets, but there are apparently secrets now. Well, how am I supposed to get up there? There we go. There's 16 secrets here. Holy shit! Merlin, medieval dates and known, most famous wizard of all time, sometimes known as the Prince of Enchanters, part of the court of King Arthur. There's another secret up here. How the fuck do I. There's two right next to each other. 
Xavier Rastrick, 750 to 1836, flamboyant wizard entertainer who vanished unexpectedly while tap dancing to a crowd of 300 in Painswick and was never seen again. Interesting. Imps are vicious little creatures. Like gnomes, you use flippendo to knock them back. Then you can pick them up and throw them into a hole to get rid of them. Flippendo! <laughs> What what is a secret I didn't see the secret. Is there a secret within the secret now? I love secrets, man. Died in freak tap dancing accident. <laughs> Found four secrets so far. A lot of secrets in this challenge. Get ready to jump. Taking all the enemies, the uh, shoals and stuff. So we're gonna keep doing that. What is this showing me? I hear something over here. Aha, it was over here. Oh. Yeah, it's only 10 bronze cards left. Let's go, baby. Getting quite close. Kuang Po. 1443 to 1539 Chinese wizard who discovered the uses of powdered fireball eggs. Nintendo! Nintendo! 
Nice. Just 10 silver and 10 bronze cards left and we are done. Dymphna Firmage or Firmage. 1612 to 1638. Famously abducted by pixies while on holiday in Cornwall and lived in mortal dread of them thereafter. Failed to persuade the Minister of Magic to have all pixies huma hum humanly destroyed. I feel like there's something here, you know? Ah. Oh my god. A little loud noise. Another silver coin. Felix Summerby, 1447 to 1508. Inventor of cheering charms. I feel like still there's something about that painting though. Because it's going inward and other paintings are not going inward. So I don't know what that shit's up with. Hearing the screams of pixies. Can I make a request? Yeah, no pixie genocide, Sanj. What a request? secret there. Can you sing the berries and cream song and do a, a little lap dance? Um, I mean, I don't know the creams and berry song. So I need to look that up. But maybe I can at some point, I guess. Maybe I can do it for the street tomorrow. You know what? I can look up the song. By tomorrow, and then I can do it tomorrow on the stream. Does that sound like a fair deal? I feel like, am I missing something? Aha! Oh no, so that was the way to get up here. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I misunderstood. I misunderstood them. Lab dance. Not lab dance. Yes, you do it. It's a masterpiece. It's a deal. Okay, yeah, okay. Nice. We have a deal. We're back here again. Oh. I feel like I'm missing something. It's from 14 year old commercial Stardust. I think. No! No, 
nothing. Okay, here I remember something about a painting. Or just something about a painting. I think it's over there. I feel like there's something here. There's something about the painting here that's incorrect of some sort. Do you remember wrong or what's happening? So that's secret. Yeah, there we go. We still have like seven secrets. It's really trending on TikTok. I see. Albrick Grenion, 1803 to 1882. Inventor of the dung bomb. <laughs> uh, nice portrait, my man. I knew there was something I was missing. How the fuck can I get? I, I think I can't get up there. You know what? We're gonna just like. No! No, I got the save book here. No, 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 no. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good at all. No. No, I can't get it. No. Alohumura? Open that bird, Pusari. How can I get the fuck up there again? There's no... There's no way, I think. No, there's absolutely no way I can bounce up there and get it, I think, now. Fuck. I missed the secret. Pretty sure I couldn't get up there. Here's the tenth secret. Celestina Warbeck, 1917 to present. Popular singing sorceress. Is that the secret here? Dude, that, this was a poor secret. But muffin cake. It's Oprah. <laughs> what do you mean muffin cake? Oh yeah, how far into the game are you? Oh. I didn't see that message, I'm sorry. Uh, I mean, we're nearly done by how the collectibles are going and stuff, too. Spongify. Spongify. No! Ah! I don't like you anymore, man. Oh. 
か。And here's the. No. Oh, no. There we go. I am safe. TT eats from Shrek. Nice job. Hengist of Woodcroft. Medieval days are known. Driven away from his home by non magical persecutors. Hengist is supposed to have settled in Scotland where he founded the village of Hogsmeade. The Three Broomsticks Inn is alleged to be Hengist's old home. I want to get up there as well. How the fuck do I get up there? Little fields and tingles in his tummy that there's gonna be a way to get up here. Maybe not. Spongify. There's apparently Something we can unlock here. Or is it just a way to get back? Maybe it's just a way to get back. I don't know. No. We lost like four secrets, dude. No. No, that was the way to go. Ah, okay. Now I see. Now it makes sense. I didn't manage to get up there. Three secrets I missed. I know one of the secrets I missed. I know one of them, but still. Well done, Harry! You've completed my sponge by challenge. The remaining time now becomes your personal high score. The weekly house point ceremony is about to start. You don't want to miss it. Okay, let's see. Can I do it immediately? And buy the Spongify challenge. I can do it. Welcome back, Harry Potter, to my f I'll afford you more house points. Thank you, thank you. Now let's see where the secrets are. <laughs> I have the cheat sheet here.
Okay. We'll take it in progression. Because there's a secret up there, and we have been to that. So there's no point in going back there. We found those two secrets. Secret in here, but we've gotten that as well. There's one to the left. We have gotten that as well, so we can just skip. Yes, the sheet sheet. Ah, okay, so there was something, okay. My intuition was correct. Missed one, dude. So the thing is, there's a secret in here. There was a secret. I'm just big dumb then. I'm just doing this just to get the stars and get more points. Say now.
There's something I'm missing. I'm missing one secret. Still. Because now I'm missing one secret. I don't know where that secret is. But we have like a, sh a cheat sheet here. through normally now. This is a secret I have been in before. Also secret I have been in. Spongebob. This is a secret that reset itself. When I died or something. here haven't I? Yeah, I've been in here. I don't know why this challenge doesn't seem to work for me. I'm gonna have to go through it again. Let's take this in steps, okay? Just wants to stay in here. Come here, come here. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Let me take this. We'll take each secret from itself. Here's the secret. Here's a secret. 
that we have been in. Then we have here, and the secret is going here. Bouncing. Unlocking. And going here. Three imps and a blob. Then each of them, I get them in the hole. Disney Plus is down, is it? Dude, that's kind of sad. Why is it down though? Do you know? Ow! Don't bite me, man. It's kind of rude. Is like this a secret in the itself? No. We went in here. Defeat four firecrafts, go down the stairs. No, but I was trying to watch Simpsons and it was loading all the time. Sad. Dude, what the fuck did Harry do there? He did 180 like a backward spin or whatever. I don't know. That was kind of odd. Well down. Dang it. This secret, yeah. Go to portraits. Go to the room, it fixes, go to lower level pattern, we'll climb back up. Sponge will cross to the star and then jump to secret. From 10 drop down below, blue muscular gold, follow the glowing ledges. Spy trap room, instead of just hitting both flipendo switches, flipendo one and go in. Oh, so that's the last secret. I didn't miss it, man. I didn't miss it. Better just do it. I know where the last secret is. Uh, 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 uh. 
No. So the trick here is that we do this. Do this. Because now we're trapped in here. And we find the last secret. Which is just beans. Wow. to do. the last secrets now. This leads to the dungeons. Yeah, I know, Harry. Not to do all of the other secrets, yes. Okay, we know this one. So just beans, dude. It's kind of let down when it's only beans. I'm looking for the cards now. Okay, so this was nothing. Where are the remaining secrets? Ah, yeah, we have this one. Archibald Alderton, 1568 to 1623, famous for blowing up the hamlet of Little Dropping in Hampshire whilst attempting to magically mix a birthday cake. Nice. That's an achievement. Lockhart is too easy on the mud blood students, if you ask me. Is it in here? There's somewhere where you can do a bounce pad. I'm uh, forgetting something, aren't I? There's one more secret here. Stairs. Which stairs? The stairs, like, you know, to go to the first, second, third and fourth floor and stuff, it's all the same. It's another round of secrets. This is a secret room that we have been in. And then we have the secret that is up there. Like up here. We've been in that one as well. Oh, sorry. I just sold my very last item a moment ago. Where's the last one? There's several more in the stairs area. We're, we're gonna get to that one, but... Where is this secret? I mean, we've been here. Was there more here? No. We've been here. The Great Hall, site of ceremonies and uh. dueling. There's no uh. secrets here, are there? I don't think there's any secrets here. But 
Just making sure. I'm trying to collect all the weird sisters. They're my favorite band. Okay. Maybe in the common room, or am I missing something here? Maybe. I'm by the Rick December challenge. Yeah, not clearly not. Them. We're missing something, you know. I feel like I'm missing something. There's the portrait of the Gryffindor common room. Like I feel like I'm missing something. You know? <gasps> there was a button up there. that do? Ah. Aha! So there was another secret up here. I believe we got all the secrets for the the Findo challenge though. Sick it. Gwen Gwenog Jones. No, six, uh, 1968 to present. Captain and beater of only all female national Quidditch team. The Holy Head Harpies. Okay, now that we have saved here. Er det Gwenog Hansen? I guess. Let's check if I got all secrets here. No, I got all seven out of seven. Let's check with the Scourge one as well. Challenge. <gasps> We're missing a secret. We're gonna have to do that then. A little more crack beam blocked by two blobs. Welcome. Dragon after encounter Peach, Scourge Blobs. Thing. 
I believe I have done this, but I'm making sure. So that was one of the secrets. Then the next one is Lumos the Gargoyle again. In the room with the gate and the witch. Oh! So is Zombie! Wow, thank you for raiding. Hi, I love this game. Oh, man, Victor, I didn't see you were here. Hey! There's a lot of stuff happening right now, so yeah. <sighs> Feed lad, thank you for following, and so is Zombie, thank you for following. Both of you have an ice cream. Um, there is supposed to be a follow... Um, uh, what's it called? Follow alert every time you guys follow me, but as of now there's a bot roaming around Twitch that harassed me so so much yesterday and just like followed, 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 followed and then the alert like went all the time so it was kind of annoying so I've turned off the alert for now until the bot like that uh, raiding bot thing mess basically is gone for a little while so you, 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 you did follow even though there was no alert right now but feel, uh, feel at home feel at home you're welcome. I'm just trying to get all the secrets uh, right now. I don't remember. Okay, so... You're going to get in room with gate and the witch statue as you go down the stairs. Go left and look for secret on left. I was playing Lego Harry Potter, so I thought I would raise you. <laughs> nice. It's been a little while since I played Lego Harry Potter, but Rick it hasn't December. been that long. I played it with my girlfriend Scott. around yeah, five months ago, I guess. We won 100% of the game, and it was kind of fun, actually. Is this correct, or did I mess up? No. This was the secret I forgot. That was just beans. Why, do, why does the secrets I forget just have to be beans? I don't know why, but it's only beans today, apparently. Yeah, there we go. No, get in. Pixies. You know this way now. Dang it! Oh, now I have to do this again! Ah. Dang it, that was just kinda lucky when I jumped in.
Wow. <laughs> nice PC. Let's just get on with this. No, no. Okay. Look at all you guys. Just Harry falling statically down like that. It's kind of funny. Last challenge star right here. And there we go. Very well done. This is the door to the scourge challenge. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. Let's get more secrets. There's more secrets to be found. We have a fun thing now, or we can go on all these bounce pads. Just to do some quick shortcuts and stuff. We're missing two secrets. Thank goodness you're all right. So there's up here that we need to do Spongebob on this pad right here to get up there. So that's one of the secrets. And there we got Chauncey Aldrich, 1342 to 1379, first known victim of dragon pox. Dragon pox. Mm. Now we can do the secret. Can do this. This is the last secret. Artemisia Lufkin, 1740, 54 to 1825. First witch to become Minister of Magic. But yeah, we're here. There's nothing in particular right here that's more expanded upon. Nothing over. Yeah, there's something up there. Not that I remember. We got Alberta Tootil, 1394 to 1483, winner of the All England Wizarding Dueling Competition of 1430. Famously overcame the favorite Samson Wiblin with a blasting curse. It's a very lovable picture. It's just to get to the several floors, I believe. Yeah, it's just a quick way to get to the different floors. I believe that in the second floor there's a little secret. This is a guy who died. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Tronsi Aldridge. Died from dragon pox. I feel like that's something that's worth ta taking up. In. It's only beans on this one. There we go. Okay, so now... Ooh. Oh, dang it. Now that we've gotten those, we are... 43. We're missing... 7. Missing 7, and we're missing 4. That seems to be appropriate. 
And we've gotten every secret, secret in the Defindo challenge, and I'm pretty certain that we've gotten everything else too. So just to make sure, I'm going to check something else as well. Outside, yeah, we're gonna check outside as well. That's the. Dang it, that's the last place I'm gonna check. It's left, yeah. Outside is the place left, I would presume, but there's also another place. This leads to the dungeons. Yeah, we know, Harry. There's no secret in the dungeons that's left. But I'm gonna just check if we got every secret. I know we got every secret on the garden, but I didn't remember to check secrets in general. So, did I get everything here? We can't go here anymore. Okay. Well then. I believe I did. But if I did miss any, you will find it. No problem. My ass though. <laughs> Streaming so long is uh, draining, you know. Jacinda Sykes, 1915 to present. Famous for flying across the Atlantic on a broomstick, the first person to do so. Dunbar Oglethorpe, 1968 to present. Chief of QUABBLE, Quidditch Union for the Administration and Betterment of the British League and its Endeavours. Yes. That's a thing, apparently. Uh huh. Oh, oh, wait, there's a. There's an owl here. Wait, wait. There's an owl here, but can we hit? Where did it go? We're missing one secret. Is it down by Hagrid's or where is it? Where is the last secret, man? Also, can we do the final? How Quidditch? could I ever forget? And the way to the Quidditch pitch. No, Harry, that's not the... Alohomora! We can't do the final match yet, so that's the thing. Animal cruelty. Is it killing the pigs? I really don't remember, though. I just wish everything would go back to normal. Okay, if you say so. Good old Hagrid's hut. Oh my god. Secret was a murder all along. Why can I even do this to begin with? Where's Hagrid by the way? Isn't he supposed to be here somewhere? see Hagrid anywhere. Okay, let me just look up. I don't want this to take all day. Ah. 
Here's the greenhouse. It's always so warm in here. You must think you're pretty great because you're a parcel mouth. No, that's not, no. There's eight secret chairs. Is there anything about this one? No. I was thinking there was something about that one, but apparently not. I'm really, really... It says outside daytime two secrets, but that's not the thing. Entrance and halls outside at night. Castle of Lomoran to banner singer from Tower each side of the gate. Spongify to reach... Down the steps on the left, the main entrance room or a crack in the window winds. The room is going to go in for a while, then enter the far right castle once you get open. Gray square patch on the roof. Thing. Castle on two banners hanging from towers. You should these positions to the wall next to the chest on the left. Inside is a chest with Spongify to reach the bronze wizard corners and be to the left of the main entrance. Yes, far left from main entrance is Castle Moran pattern on the wall. Yeah, down steps to the left of the main entrance, a little more crack in the window winds. Yeah, Lumen Scorgle and four above, then run to the far right. The castle finds your opening. Gray square patch, and then there's the, the one that was on the night. Daytime. Flip handle pattern above archway on the way to the greenhouse. The the winds past and to the right of Sprout's class. Flip handle pattern above archway on the way to the greenhouse. Pattern above the archway on the way to the greenhouse. There's no pattern above here. Is this where they meant? Or like, I'm. Um, How about a trade, Harry? How about a trade, Harry? Or is this. Th yeah! Lependo! There was a thing there. Cyprian Udall, 1312 to 1357. Only Quidditch referee ever to die during the match. The origin of the curse was never called, but believed to have been a member of the crown. As you can see, a person dying again. Nintendo! But yeah, so we got that. Wonders have the park, yeah. It was on the other side, apparently. So now we've gotten all the secrets, I believe. Makes sense, because the only places left to go after this is we're gonna go to the Forbidden Forest and to the Chamber of, Chamber of Secrets. And that makes sense, because then there's two silver cards and six bronze cards hidden. Because right here, we have gotten everything. We've gotten everything we could get right here. So there's no problem. Let's do the bean bonus room because now we can do a lot of shit in the bean bonus room. 
A lot of stuff we can do in the bean bonus room, baby. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Looks like it's time for another house point ceremony. Let's see which house is ahead this week. Oh, it appears that Gryffindor is in the lead. Harry, it looks like you get to visit the bonus bean room. There's a lot of beans on top of there. Can we even get there? I don't know if we can even get there. There's all the beans everywhere, man. It's just go where all the beans are. This room is really, really, really good. Makes me really happy. hiding though. I think we've gone for every like path to take. I think. I mean there's these. Beams. I think we've basically gotten every single bean we can get at this point. There's really nothing left, kind of. No, I feel satisfied. Not those, though. I don't know how to get those, but. I think I managed to do it, just hold back. No. Oh my god. No! No! So close. What's happening? Hey, Harry! Did Something has really <laughs> upset Moaning Martel. He mean more than usual. I could hear her wailing all the way from the grand staircase. 
And the court outside her bathroom is flooded again. You don't think someone else has been attacked, do you? Anything could have happened. Come on, let's go see what's up. Scary time, yeah. Oh, Erbas, thank you for following. Thank you so much Come for following. On, Harry. As I mentioned earlier, the tw uh, the follower alert is turned off for now since there ha is a bot lurking around that has been, uh, you know, spamming people's follows and like follower alerts and stuff all the time. And it happened to me yesterday, and it was kind of annoying. So for now, we're turned off. So uh, turn off the alerts. But thank you for following so much. I love the yeah. This game is really good. This is childhood for me, so this is a really, really good game. Here's the book. Who's that? Can't you throw something else at me? Someone threw something at you? Yes, they did. It's over there. Careful! My dad told me some books can be very dangerous. Um. It looks like an old diary. Belong to T.M. Riddle. <gasps> Whoever he was, he didn't write in it. It's completely It's blank. Rob Puzzle. <laughs> Piece of the stand. Hello, Harry Potter. My name is Tom Riddle. No, it's Rob Puzzle. I'm at Hogwarts and horrible stuff's been happening. Do you know about the Chamber of Secrets? Of course I know about the Chamber of Secrets. In my fifth year, the chamber was opened and the monster killed a girl. I caught the person who'd opened the chamber and he was expelled. I can show you if you like. I can take you inside my memory of the night of my court. Harry was entranced by the memory Tom Riddle showed him. Come on. Gotta get you out of here. Come on now. In the box. It's all right. Come on out. There you go. Evening, Rubeus. What are you doing down here, Tom? It's all over. I don't think you meant to kill anyone. But monsters don't make good pets. It never killed no one. Come on. The least Hogwarts can do is make sure the thing that killed that girl is slaughtered. It wasn't him. He wouldn't. He never. Stand aside. No! No. Harry had always known that Hagrid had an unfortunate liking for large, monstrous creatures. But he was equally certain that Hagrid would never mean to kill anybody. Riddle might have got the wrong person. Maybe some other monster was attacking people. How many monsters do you think this place can hold? We always knew Hagrid was expelled. And the attacks must have stopped then. Otherwise, Riddle wouldn't have got his award. Riddle's diary! It's gone! What? But only a Gryffindor could have stolen it. Nobody else knows our password. Exactly. Kill this time. Let me rip. This is scary shit. <laughs> I just heard it again. Didn't you? I didn't hear anything. Harry, I think I've just understood something. I've got to go to the library. Okay, okay, come down, come down. McGonagall said we have to stay in here unless we're in class. And I've got to talk to Hagrid. If he set the monster loose last time, he knows how to get inside the Chamber of Secrets. Hagrid's hut is out in the grounds, Harry. But you know that. Follow me, Harry. That was just one, yeah. Can I make more of it? Oh, we can make more. Okay, let's go. Let's go. By the way, PC, how is your sleep schedule right now? When do you like go to bed and when do you wake up?
saw someone who looks very much like Lucius Malfoy coming into Hagrid's heart. Bad business, Hagrid. A very bad business indeed. Things have gone far enough. As chairman of the school governors, I've simply got to act and send you away. Away? Away to where? Not the wizard prison. Not Azkaban. I'm afraid so. A dreadful thing, Dumbledore. But all twelve of the governors feel it's time for you to step aside. As of this moment, you are suspended as headmaster of Hogwarts. If the governors want my removal, Lucius, I shall, of course, step aside. No! However, you will find that I will only truly have left this school when none here are loyal to me. You will also find that help will always be given at Hogwarts no. <laughs> to those who ask for it. Uh, but Peter asked you a question. What of course, your if sleep? anyone wanted to find out some stuff, all they'd have to do would be to follow the spiders. That'd lead them, right? That's the key to the whole thing. And that's all I'm saying. Come along now, Hagrid. Yeah, what is your sleep oh, schedule right, right now, Peter? I'm coming. When do you go to bed and when do you wake now? up? Oh, Dumbledore. I wake There'll up at 12. There'll be an attack okay. day with him gone. Kind Look, of what I do right over now. over there! Looks like they're heading for the Forbidden Forest. And I sleep when I sleep. <laughs> okay. Understandable. Um. Uh, it's, it's, okay. This ledge is too high to climb. I'll give you a leg up, Harry. You'd have to break the Forbidden Forest alone. This is the scariest part of the game. <laughs> yeah, kind of is. Good luck, Harry! It kind of uh, is the scariest part, yeah. So we got four secrets. Just four. Get this game on the Xbox. Cowards. <laughs> yeah, nice. Do get it if you can on uh, consoles. But uh, do remember that the Xbox version is different than the one that I'm playing right now because this is ex exclusively the PC version. There's like there's five different versions of Philosopher's Stone and Chamber of Secrets. We got the PlayStation One, PC, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, and then you also have the the PlayStation 2 and Xbox gen, with PlayStation 2, Xbox and GameCube versions of the game being similar. So, do have that in mind. This is specifically not a... Uh, not the same as the one on Xbox. Dude, why is it so foggy in here? What the fuck? Cleown Medieval. It's an Irish druidess who discovered properties of Moondu. I couldn't pronounce it. It's not the Xbox One, it's the first Xbox from 2001. No, it's... Yeah, I know, but that's what I'm saying. The original Xbox, PlayStation 2 and GameCube is of the same era, basically. And those have the same version of Philosopher's Stone and Chamber of Secrets. So, this Chamber of Secrets is just PC exclusive, this version of the game. So, yeah. But it's not, uh, yeah, it's not the same. It's still a very good Chamber of Secrets. I would say that the PlayStation 2, Xbox and GameCube Chamber of Secrets is better than this one. Though. But it's different, just be forewarned. Oh, 
Why do I have to? Uh, just eat them up. Please. And it was not the same, it's different. Jump scare, yeah. I'll just let you guys eat these. I don't think that made any difference, but... Check, I got a message here. What is this? <coughs> oh shit. Ah. That's that there's this thing here about the secrets. I already played the first game and I know PC games are just sometimes diff more different than on the console versions. Wasn't there something there? I mean I mean there was something like here, you know? But it doesn't seem to be like something I can do. You know? I don't know. I don't know if I've messed up something. Or not. You know what? Let me just take a suicide. Because there's something in this. Yeah, the little spiders come out of that hole. Where? What thing? This thing you mean? Because these little spiders came out of the hole. So that doesn't seem to be a thing. There's nothing above me. Nothing in particular below me either. Never mind, yeah. It says Cave full of webs and spiders. Defend the webs, defeat spiders, a section of the wall will open. Three imps ahead, they jump in water and wade to the surface. After the log, your crossing drops, turn around within the bucket. Winter Sentra! Winter! I don't know. I don't really know. Spongify! Maybe it's a little problem with the version I'm using. I don't know. Spongify! 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 I knew it. Secret. But this wasn't a secret, it was a card. But yeah. Gifford Ollerton. 1392 to 1441. Famous giant slayer. Killed the giant Hengist of Upper Barnton. Still feel like I've missed something, you know? This is, yeah, this is the case.
this is what was uh, talked about. It was not the uh, small thing. There we go. That was the thing I was thinking of, or looking for, in particular. No, that was the last silver card. <gasps> there's no, there's apparently no more silver cards in the Chamber of Secrets. I thought there were, but yeah. Gondolin Oliphant, 1720 to 1799. Famous for studies of life and habits of trolls. Clubbed to death in a Cotswolds while sketching. Gotten everything. Yeah, okay. Another, oh, another card. Perpetua Fancourt, 1900 to 1999, which reinvented a lunascope. Perpetua. That's a beautiful name. Throw you off the ledge. No, no, come on. I'm gonna throw you off the ledge, okay? No, okay, it doesn't work. Dang it. I wanted to throw him off the ledge, but apparently he does not want me to do. Oh, there was... okay. What's the last secret? After the blog, your crossing drops? Okay, yeah. Come up there later. Yeah, okay. Harold Porter, 1980 to 1981, the boy who died. <laughs> ah, beautiful. Beautiful. There's a card up there now, I need to get it. Oh -ho. Dorcas Well Beloved, 1812 to 1904, founder of the Society of Distressed Witches. Okay, we just missing three bronze cards now. No, is it? Uh, what the fuck? Get in your hole now. 
for the me to get rid of this, but I don't care. Secret is behind. Commander! <gasps> 1897 to present. Celebrated author of Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find. Look at him. It's Newt Scamander. He's from the other movies. <laughs> We're missing him now. Snoots. <gasps> Hello, Ryuk. You guys back from uh, the eye toy session? How was it, by the way? Oh. Uh. Fantastic Beast spoiler. Wow. Now we're still playing. Oh, okay, I see. You're just stopping by. I see. What are. Which one in particular are you playing now? Second or third or which one do you play? Oh, it's boss fight. Boss fight. Aragog, a human is here. Is it Hagrid? No, I'm a friend of Hagrid's. I came to help him. Why does Hagrid need help? Some say that Hagrid released a monster long ago in Hogwarts. It killed someone and it must have come back. It was me he released, but he sent me away. I've never gone back and I've never heard anyone in Hogwarts. So you're not the guardian of the Chamber of Secrets? No, the Guardian is an ancient creature that spiders fear above all others. It kill a girl in the bathroom, not I. Thank you. I think I should go now. No, you won't. I cannot deny my children such fresh meat. Goodbye, <laughs> friend. I realize of I Hagrid. could have you on my phone. Currently the first one. Okay. If I, I see. cut those support webs with Defindo, I bet Aragog will fall into the pit. I mean, why can't Harry just Bite run? Him, my children. Okay, why didn't Harry just go back? He was on an upper ledge. They didn't force him down there. Why did he just go back? So many men. The log dropped. I learned something from Lockhart's class. Rictus Emperor. <laughs> Amazing work, Harry. And look, I found that car. But Hermione has been attacked. You sure took that spider to the like yes, I the did. others. <laughs> oh no! We should get back oh, as best soon of as man. possible. Thank you for following. Climbing. By the way, welcome to the stream and welcome to the community. 
hope you're doing good. Um, as I've mentioned to currently other people, there is a follower alert usually, but it's uh, not on for now since there's a bot going around that's been uh, harassing Twitch streamers amongst me yesterday, and it's been kind of annoying. So yeah, hi Harry, where were you fighting a spider? Why are you here? You fighting a spider? I better not let Madame Pomfrey see me. <laughs> There's Hermione. What's that she's holding? It's a note in her handwriting. Here's what it says. Of the many fearsome beasts and monsters that roam our land, there is none more deadly than the basilisk, the king of serpents. This snake, which may reach gigantic size and live hundreds of years, is born from a chicken's egg, hatched beneath a toad. Aside from its deadly and venomous fangs, the basilisk has a horrible stare, and all who are fixed with the beam of its eye shall suffer instant do death. The room now? Spiders flee from the basilisk, for it is their mortal enemy. The basilisk flees only from the crowing of the rooster, which is fatal to it. But how's the basilisk been getting around the place? A giant snake! Someone would have seen! Pipes, Ron! It's been using the plumbing! I've been hearing that voice inside the walls! That girl who died! Aragog said she was found in a bathroom. What if she never left the bathroom? What if she's still there? You don't think. Not moaning myrtle. The entrance to the Chamber of Secrets. What if it's in moaning, moaning myrtle's, myrtle's bathroom? bathroom? All students are to return to their house dormitories at once. All teachers return to the staff room immediately, please. Oh no! Not another attack! This is so sad. Yes, there had been another attack. The worst one yet. This time, someone had disappeared. It was Ginny Weasley. And another message was left on a wall. It said her skeleton will lie in the chamber forever. Hogwarts would surely close now. Professor Lockhart had been given the task of rescuing Ginny, but Ron and Harry were beside themselves with worry. They had to do something. Hurry, Harry! We have to save Ginny! We need to have a plan. I'll go to Moaning Myrtle's bathroom and try to find the entrance to the Chamber of Secrets. What and should I'll I do? go find Lockhart. It wouldn't surprise me if he was trying to sneak out of Hogwarts. I feel like I want to go to the gold room after Chamber of Secrets, since then I have every single card. The bronze ones as well, even though I don't need them. If that's okay for you, PC. I always usually go for this at the end of the, the game. So I'm going to do that then, I think. I can go to it now, but I want to do the game first. possible without Nick? I think so. Not entirely sure though, but I think. What do you want this time? To ask you how you died. You're the first one who ever asked. I died in this very stall. I remember it so well. The door was locked and I was crying because Olive Hornby had teased me about my glasses. Then I heard somebody come. They said something odd in a different language, I think. It was a boy speaking. So I unlocked the door to tell him to go and use his own bathroom. And then I died. <laughs> Where was this boy standing? Over there by the sink. Stand One of them the has never baby. worked. Not as long as I've been here. <laughs> I wonder if that's Deep. where the entrance to the chamber is. Open! Open! That's not working. Maybe if I try parcel tongue. Open! That's got it. Open! <laughs> Go 
got him. He was packed and ready to go. What's that? I think it's the entrance to the Chamber of Secrets. Well, then, you won't be needing me. Cheers, boys. Have to go warm up my broom. You're not through yet. Down you go. No! Come on, Harry. <laughs> this is it. No, say something. <laughs> Salami. <laughs> Salami. Okay, let's go. Go down to the dungeons and see if you can get into the common room. Huh? Hurry up, Harry. Every second counts. I don't know why I said dungeon for them. Harry! There's something up there! I... I feel faint. The adventure ends here, boys. Run! Say goodbye to your memories. Obliviate! Ron! Are you okay? Ron! Getting close I'm to here! Okay! Yeah. Go some trouble, Harry! Wait there with Lockhart. If I'm not back in an hour... Anyway, see you in a bit! Uh-oh. Secrets. It's just a frog. <laughs> Trying to just name move now. Never tried it. Oh, I've never tried that myself either. Sounds interesting. <laughs> Sounds very interesting though. Alohomora! Alohomora! Just a lot of beings here. Be some crusty old beans, yeah. Very old beans, <laughs> and the wizard cards, of course. The <laughs> frog.
one of three secrets. Just making sure I get the secrets that I'm going for here. Man. Okay, we're getting close to the end here. Just double check. Fire crab and pixies don't stand on the great for pendos and they carvings on opposite walls. Wall slides back. Go down on the left. Be sure to defend the rope on the right before you go down. Four secrets here, yeah. Oh, 
hein Ah, I'm so confused. Wait a little confused. This new was boring. <laughs> well, let's get to new at least. Which one are you gonna try now? Oh, dang it. Ah, I messed up, I messed up. Ah. Two secrets left. The bronze cords have to be here somewhere. We're missing just two. The best in my opinion, so if you play two. Yeah, I think I agree on that one. I agree on that one. There's nothing on this one, but there's a frog here. Fred Elphick. 11, 12, 11, 19. First wizard to be gored by an African rampant. Nice. Maybe <laughs> 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 
This is where the boulder is, isn't it? Yeah, this is where the boulder chase is. Um, Secrets PC. Um, what's it called again? I missed one bronze card. I don't know where that one is though. Boy, after, but no HP bar for you. <laughs> and then I can buy after, but I'm really curious where the last one was. That's the thing. I'm really, really, really curious where the last one was. I want to wonder which car it is and where it was. Steel? No. Biome Castile. Do, do, do you need to help me? How to pronounce your name? I do really need help pronouncing your name. Hey bro, did you play the first game? Yeah, I played the first game. I played uh, Philosopher's, Philosopher's Stone before I did this one. To figure out which card I'm missing as of now. I think we have lost one there. Maybe it's in the not green grand staircase. Not Rector Sempra, se, Rector Sempra challenge. Not the Scourge challenge. Why corn horn quest? Clanmore Peaks. Clanmore Peaks sounds familiar. Here is yeah. Cornelius Agrippa. 
Yes. Miranda Gorshon. Grogan Stark. Yeah. Mervyn the Malicious. Ulrich the Oddball. Durban Shimpling. Glen M. Stork. Elodora Ketteridge. Lord Stoddard Withers. Thaddeus Thurkel. Tilly Toak. Burdock Muldoon. Roderick Plumpton. Patrix Bloxham. Devlin Whitehorn. Edgar Stroudsler. Cersei. Alfred the Clag. Adelvar Waffling. Justice Pilvico. Yardle Platt. Morgan Le Fay. Merlin. Kong Po. Celestina Warbeck. Celestina Warbeck. Yeah, we got Celestina Warbeck. Trying to figure out a way to play all the old age begins and advice. Uh, yeah, uh, just go to oldgamesdownload.com. They have a beautiful community where they just post and release old games that you can download and use on newer hardware. And I just went on that site, went for Philosopher's Stone and Chamber of Secrets, downloaded them, and voila, works perfectly, no problem. You may need to tweak a little things in the set of files to just get it better HD, or a, a better HD, but better resolution if you want to. But it's very simple, it's very simple. Just go to oldgamesdownload.com and you can find a bunch of old PC games that they have tried to re like archive, basically. So they do not get forgotten and stuff. So that's very good. Perpetua Fancourt. Dork as well, but Newt's Commander, yeah. Like, I'm missing one. Where is it? Which co I'm, I'm not giving up until I know which one it is. I'm not giving up. I am not giving up this easily. Okay, let's just go over and see if we have them. Hesper Starkey, yes. Have locks waiting. Yes. Gulliver Pogby. Yes. Normal Twan. Yes. Mirror. No. Beaumont Major Banks. Just in the Sykes. And yeah, just in the Sykes. Elmeric Sawbridge. Hilda of Gorsmore. Yeah. Bowman Wright. That's a new one we got, isn't it? Bob and Roy should be kind of... No, it's, is it going to be early? Dude, I'm so lost. Am I blind or something? Where... Where's Bowman Wright? No, that's a silver card. Oh my god, I'm so blind. That was a silver card. Archibald Alderton. Oh, 
Archibald Alberton. Ethelred the Ever Ready. Yeah. Glover Hipworth. Glover Hipworth, Mungo Bonham. Musidora Barkworth. No. I don't have Mesidora Bark with, which is a bronze card which is in the defense against a dark arts classroom. So there's one missing in the dark arts classroom, apparently. Huh. Well, we know where to go then after this. That's the last one I forgot. There's a chest there, apparently. I didn't know there was no! a chest there. behind me. I don't like that. We're soon there. PC, you still here? We're soon at the end. I'm gone. <laughs> what happens if I fall down? I got never secret. No? I have not got never secret. What's the last secret? Okay, haven't kind of, we haven't missed any actually. Just doesn't want to appear apparently. I want to get out again. Don't wake. Tom? Tom Riddle? She's still alive, but only just. Little Ginny's been writing in my old diary for months. She poured out her soul to me. It made me stronger until I had enough power to pour a little of my soul back into her. What do you mean? Ginny Weasley opened the Chamber of Secrets, just as I had long ago, before I became... Lord Voldemort. <gasps> no! Rob Puzzle. She's under <laughs> age, Tom. <laughs> Genie. It is me, Harry. Genie told me all about you. I'm afraid that your second year magic tricks will be worthless against the power of the greatest sorcerer I in the world. I put myself in here. The greatest sorcerer in the world is Albus Dumbledore. Dumbledore is gone! 
Now I'm going to teach you a lesson. Let's match the powers of Tom Riddle, heir of Slytherin, against the famous Harry Potter. That's a phoenix. Forks! A sword from Dumbledore. No doubt afraid to come himself. Well, it won't save you, Harry Potter. Speak to me, Slytherin, greatest of the Hogwarts. This is why I also love the second movie, because it's like Harry's fighting with a sword and everything, and it's way cooler than everything else. And it's like, it sets up like the Horcruxes very early, and like the, the sword and everything. them dodges. Just have to hit him when he's shooting out his goo. Where did that fire come from? I don't know. Don't question it. The particle effects though. No! Wow. Sad. Harry, oh Harry. I wanted to tell you. It was me, Harry. But I swear I didn't mean to. 
Riddle made me do it. It's all right. Riddle's finished. Come on, Ginny. Let's get out of here. Also, it sets up the love lob thing with uh, Ginny early. Hello, Harry. Professor Dumbledore. Second movie in the book is I way better. I thought you'd been suspended. Lucius hey, Ginny, let's make it a thankful boy. Curse the board <laughs> if they didn't remove me. But they decided to stand up to him. Now that the heir is gone and the basilisk is destroyed, they know Hagrid is innocent too. He'll be back in his hut soon. Yeah. What about Lucius Malfoy? Will he cause any more trouble? I doubt it. We can assume it was him who got the diary to Ginny. He daren't do it again unless he wants the Ministry of Magic after him. About Professor Lockhart, I'm afraid he's lost his memory. Oh dear. What will he think about now that he can't think about himself? Just don't give his job to Professor Snape. He's too, um, valuable as a potions teacher. You've all performed brilliantly. It must have been a terrible experience. It was. We spent much more time in the girls' bathroom than I would have liked. <laughs> Being petrified was look. awful, but I learned a great deal from it. I'm going to write a paper about it for extra credit. When you've got your friends to help you, you can accomplish anything. And nothing is too awful. Well, almost nothing. Looking like Goyle came close. There's a banquet waiting for you downstairs. What do you propose for the first toast? To friendship. Loyalty. And courage. But to friendship most of all. GG, thank you. We're well, not done yet. The rest of the final term passed in a haze of blazing sunshine. Hogwarts was back to normal with only a few small differences. Defense against the Dark Arts classes were cancelled and Lucius Malfoy had been sacked as a school governor. Draco was no longer strutting around the school as though he owned the place. On the contrary, he looked resentful and sulky. On the other hand, Ginny Weasley was perfectly happy again. This is our last day at Hogwarts. Yeah, the only thing left to do is the House Cup ceremony in the Great Hall. If you have anything you want to do at Hogwarts, you'd better do it before you go to the House Cup ceremony. Thank you. Too big animated is. Yes. Okay, so we... We are missing one card. So the card is up above. Like, really? Filch hasn't been present in the game whatsoever. Really. He was just at the start and then he's never showed up ever again. Like, legit. He hasn't showed up at all. I don't know why. Also, Snape hasn't really been showed that much either. Or McGonagall. Really, any of the characters. <laughs> So apparently there's a chest. Here's the defense against the dark arts classroom. Where's the chest I missed? Apparently there's a. Ah, oh, there. Alan. Here's the last card. This was the. This was the only one I lost. Okay, I thought it was weird. There was nothing in this room. Musidora Barkwith, 1520 to 1666. Composer of the unfinished Wisting Suite, which features an exploding tuba. Its performance has been banned since its performance in 1902, when it blew the roof out of the Ackerley Town Hall. Nice. Uh, uh. It's basically just the one card in the Chamber of Secrets, which was like you were in, you were inevitably gonna get it either way. So. So now the only remaining thing is to do this. I don't think there's anything else, is there? I don't think there's anything else. No, you know what? What does it say? 4,130. Is that like the max you can get or something? There's one last match we can take as well. But we're at the top here. So yeah, let's go. Yeah, Quidditch, yeah. We have one Quidditch match left. We can do that after this.
This is a fun part though. Yeah, let's go. So we're basically going to get 10 or 11 of these cards. First gold card, Bertie Bot. Trying to be fast here, so we need to focus. Albus Dumbledore. Let's just look at them when we get them. Pretty bot. 19... Wait, are they? Yeah, they are silver. Okay. Pretty bot. 1935 to present. Inventor of Bertie Bot's every flavor beans. Dumbledore. Headmaster of Hogwarts. Let's go. Let's go. 360. That was an end. No, oh, actually not. Gryffindor, medieval dates unknown. Co-founder of Hogwarts gave his name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. Foul, ancient Greek, first known creature of the basilisk. Yeah, let's go. Spongify. Salazar of Slytherin Medieval, dates a known co-founder of Hogwarts, gave his name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. Let's go. Okay, was it just like a long corridor and that was it? Helga Hufflepuff, medieval dates unknown. Co-founder Hogwarts gave her name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. Okay, I thought that was something special, but apparently not. Montague Knightley, 1506 to 1588, Wizard Chess Champion. Celsus, 1493 to 1541, contemporary of Copernicus and Leonardo da Vinci, a medieval genius whose bold theories challenged medieval thought, credited with discovering parcel tongue. Uh, 
Let's see where this was going. Rick to Sentra. Rick to Sentra. Ah, so if I... Okay, so it was basically if I started the right way, it would have taken me quicker, basically. And I did take the right way. I'm so confused. Carlotta Pinkstone, 1922 to present, famous campaigner for lifting the International Confederation of Wizards Statue of Secrecy and telling non-magical folks that wizards still exist. Miss Pinkstone has been imprisoned several times for her blatant and deliberate use of magic in public places. Excuse me? Why was her card... Why does her card move? What? I've never seen a card before. Is it Helga? No, it's not Helga, it's Rina Rib. Medieval Desino, co-founder of Hogwarts, gave her name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. These are pretty cool, I have to say. Wow. Just a big portrait of the cards with like some animations and some cool backgrounds and stuff. Ooh, nice. Yeah, I love these. are the 10 cards. I have absolutely every card. All 101 wizard cards collected. Look at them low res PNGs. <laughs> but they were cool for the time, I must say. They were pretty cool when I was a child. So now that we've done that, the only thing left is Quidditch. But as you saw on the challenge things or the uh, what were they called again the uh, I can't remember on these challenges like the the sponge boy challenge and like the scourge challenge and everything I did have like no, where was it like it says that I have like four like I mean that's the maximum points I could get I guess but still Like, we see Miss Norris and stuff, but where the fuck is Felch now? Like, literally, where is Felch? I think it's just the max time. I guess. I guess it is. Not that sure, though, but I guess. Now we're just missing Quidditch. Oh, a near miss for Potter. Oh, it's 
off to the snitch. The Slytherin Seeker is going for the snitch. Here comes the Slytherin Seeker. The snitch narrowly evades Malfoy. Potter's going for it. Oh. And the action has moved into the trench surrounding the pitch. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Anything can happen in Quidditch, even when you don't know what it is. Try to imagine the feverish competition going on in the trench. I know I am. Oh. Yes. Got it. This year's winner of the Quidditch Cup, Gryffindor! Yay! <laughs> Just a random kick That's at it, them. Wizards and Witches. The season's over, and Gryffindor takes the Quidditch Cup this year! Nice. I think I've never seen this screen actually. No, that doesn't seem to have. I don't think I've seen that screen actually. No, literally, I don't think I've seen that screen ever before in my life. Maybe I've never done the six match before when I played as a child. I don't know, it feels weird. It feels very weird. Very weird. But then I think everything is actually complete right now. What I'm gonna just quickly do though. There's the portrait of the great common room. I'm just gonna make a save here and then I'm gonna go to the house. 100% baby What do you have? I have wig and tree bark You're passing up a bargain But have it your way Just switches to another voice completely after. Bargain. Attention, please. Students, attention. The headmaster wants to address you. Silence. It isn't too late to lose house points, you know. This house cup ceremony brings the school year to an end. And an eventful year it was. Without further ado, I shall now present the cup to the Hogwarts house with the most points. Think we'll take it again this year? After you and Harry saved Hogwarts, I should think so. In fourth place, Ravenclaw. Thank you for not saying last place. In third place, Hufflepuff. Thank you. We find finishing in the middle to be quite adequate. Um. And now... For the second place, house. Place one seven, place one it'll Gryffindor. be you, Gryffindors. You're naturally second best. You won't steal the house cup from Slytherin like you did last year. After barely escaping disqualification, Slytherin. What? That means first place, and the house cup goes to Gryffindor. Yes, we did it again. Rebound, baby. Let's go. Let's go. And that was the end. Then they never held the house cap ever again, yes. 
So yeah, this game was made made by No Wonder. There's different developers for different games. But let me just give an example. two animators it showed <laughs> um, okay so these are the games that they made okay they made brother bear for, <laughs> with unreal engine 1 they made this game in unreal engine 1 by the way incredibly so they made brother bear finding nemo harry potter and chamber secrets harry potter and philosopher's stone Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, Lemony Snicket's a series of unfortunate events, Shrek, Shark Tale, and Shrek 2 the game. And that's it. And these were all PC games, of course. So they made the Harry Potter games. The print that they made. No, okay, they won't. They, okay, they made the Philosopher's, Philosopher's Stone, then Chamber of Secrets, then Finding Nemo, Brother Bear, then Lemony Snicket's a series of important events, and then Shrek 2, the game. And Shrek 2. Yeah. Sounds like bangers, ah. But this, this game in particular has a lot of fond memories for me as a child. So it's really good to just have played through it again, even though like the developers really didn't make a lot of games. But it's cool. It's cool. Shit. So yeah, this was kind of interesting. It was kind of interesting to play through my childhood game like this again. As I've said, we played through Philosopher's Stone. And now this, and then I'm gonna probably start up and play... Uh, uh, yeah, and play uh, The Prisoner of Azkaban at some point soon too, since we played through these two. But it's this one specifically that's very close to my heart since I played this a lot in my childhood on our old uh, Windows 2000 computer out in my dad's office. So it's been uh, quite an experience, quite an experience indeed. So now it's just going through it again, I guess. Um, can I do anything? Now it's just gonna repeat itself. So, yeah. yeah, it's just gonna continue. So yeah, much childhood. Yeah, it was a very good childhood. A very good childhood I had indeed. So this was a very lovable and fun thing that I have now done. I feel like. It was well worth it, in my opinion, to just play through this again. I really want to get it to work on the old computer, though. You know what? I want to try and get all of these files over to the old computer, the Windows 2000 computer, and just try to play the game on that again, because that would have been an amazing experience. So I want to try and do that at some point, actually. Why? Just because it's another experience to play the game than doing it this way. I'm just sitting in my old room playing on my new modern PC and the game is running smooth. I want it to be a little more choppy and then listen to the 
the music being a little off. End times. Ah. So it's kind of special. It's kind of special, but I want to do it. Okay. Oh. It falls on the floor. Yeah. Same shit. Well, either way, I thank you all for watching this stream. We're going to do uh, My Sims Agents for the DS tomorrow. So that's going to be a fun experience. So yeah, so hopefully I'll see you guys for the stream tomorrow. And then I'll probably make a schedule either tomorrow night or through the Monday. We'll see. Uh, we'll have to see because there's going to be the end of the stuff towards the weekend again. So we'll have to see what we do. So yeah, but uh, have a good night. And then see you guys for the next stream another day, which will be tomorrow. Yes, okay. Thanks for now.